Same thing, my mom's. Mamadas? Oh, bro, that's my middle name. Oh, bro. shit. Yes, <laughs> thought it was a gazelle. <laughs> it's gazelle. <laughs> yeah, that's my Jonathan Gazelle Rails. Uh, this one we're going with? <laughs> yeah, we go with right, it. some set. Right. Some horny shit. Like, some horny shit right here. You gotta rap like you're talking. Yeah, 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 that right. horny shit. Yeah. <laughs> my thumb in the butt, oh, I tell her what's up. Yeah. What she look at me in the eye and I smack her one more time. Uh, what I do? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Tell me she doesn't like me. Why? Cause I fucked her sister She wanted me back But I fucked her brother I took oh, that back Hey Hey What? Had a badass Damn so Thought I looked at What? Uh huh So I took that Uh huh What else? And I shot that Bow 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 I caught a case And I told her put her in her place So Woo! I slapped that Shit oh, oh, yeah. 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 Slap that Damn yeah. 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 You yeah. slap that? Yeah. Slap that Alright yeah. let's hear Hans Let's hear Hans Yeah Yeah Uh yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, bitch, I got a case. Damn. OJ Simpson. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. I didn't do shit. Yeah. Oh. Oh, he, did. he fucking paid me. Oh. Yeah. I don't say shit. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Uh. Yeah. yeah. First yeah. degree Rex. murder. Yeah. yeah. Rex. First degree murder. Uh, back to Rex's yeah. roots. Yeah. Back to Rex's yeah. roots. Yeah. Rex's, roots. Rex's uh. roots. I got A, B, C. Yeah. D, E, F, G. G. Oh. 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 Hey. Oh. Hey. Shit. Yeah. They spells high. Got oh, you damn. W -X -Y -Z. And I'm kinda high. Yeah. Lalo, give me your Wi Fi. Yeah. Cause I get bad signal and I'm trying to watch these mills that are in the single area next to me. Yeah. God damn. One time I was playing hide and seek. I went into my mom's room just to play so they don't get a peek. And she was giving head on the bed. Yo. What the, what the fuck, Gazelle, talk to me, Gazelle, talk uh, to me. All I heard was, wah, wah, pick wah, us up, wah, pick wah, us wah, up, wah. pick us up. Yeah, <laughs> and I'm chilling with the homie, Hans. Uh, and the homie, Saul. Saul. And the homie, Rex. 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 But who's next? Rex. I say I got a girl, <laughs> but who's next? Hey. Ah. Cause you know I'm fucking filoso. Filoso. Yeah. 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 Filoso. And it turned out she had piojos. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Itchy, itchy, bitch. 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 Yeah. Itchy, itchy, bitch. Why you got bugs on your head? That shit's nasty, bitch. Uh, Váyate. Váyate. Váyate, por favor. God damn. Uh, I said, God who's damn. next? I said, who's, who's next? next? And I got molested by a trans woman. Yeah. I got molested hey, yo, what the by fuck? a trans What the fuck? My mama. Hey. We're Lalo, not getting go ahead, go ahead. monetized. Damn, I can feel damn, damn. And Gazelle got molested by a trans bitch. Yeah. Gazelle got molested by a trans bitch. I can still hear his balls clapping on her cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> Whose balls, hers or mine? Whose balls, hers or mine? Yeah. Yeah. Rex's balls, crazy. hers or mine? Oh. All right, ready? Mine. And we love it because, ooh, it's your boy, Lalo. It's your boy, I-N-F-I-N-I-T-E-D-R-E -I -I -E 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 from the AM to I motherfucking Z, baby. Yes, sir. Good. It's motherfucking Gazelle who comes where, Lalo? Honestly. Belly, got two sirens, and we got the homie Bethel running the ones and twos, and we got bueno, bueno, hey, buenos dias. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the number one podcast in the Galactic Universe. Sean, ponte las pilas. Now on Radio Lasse. Highly requested video. Highly requested. I uh, guess. <laughs> yes, yeah. Thanks for pointing out, boys. Nah, thank yeah, you guys yeah. for having us. This is dope. We are uh, same thing. Guys. A lot of people always ask us when we say who we should collab with. Yeah. P.O.P. Yeah. What's up, what's up, everybody? You know I'm Hans Esquivel. Thank you guys for tuning in. Yes, uh, you heard, yeah. You guys are coming from Bueno Bueno. Thank you for pressing the play button. Shout out to the boys right Appreciate here. Yeah. 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 My name is Rex. Shout out to you guys for inviting. Yeah. And who's next, huh, Rex? Oh, Cut the check. <laughs> what else rhymes? Uh, I'm not a rapper, bro. For a sack, I don't know. For a sack, I was yeah, just on a flag. On deck. We don't, we we, not all of us have the roots of being a rapper, Rex. Chill, chill, chill. I'm bad, bro. Yeah. I wasn't in Rex, guys, bro. I, I didn't get invited, bro. Damn. I, was I only, remember that shit. I was only in SOS. For just You weren't in Japan? <laughs> Damn. Uh <-huh. laughs> Did you guys beef with anybody, by the way? No? 
We're, talk, we're talking about party cruise, by the way. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Before we started, like... We were talking about it off by screen. Party cruise. At the time, I don't know, bro. I don't think so. I mean, my homie, my homie Zeke at the... Uh, well, he's still my homie. But my homie at the time, we were always hanging out, bro. I remember he told me, he's like... Hey, bro, you want to be a part of this fucking pretty boy uh, crew? Oh. <laughs> and I was like, oh, like that? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, so who recruits, though? Like, who's like, who's the one that says, yeah, you pretty? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> that's the main, the main head. head. <laughs> that's, that's what I want to know. Like, I got a that's message right, yeah. on Facebook, Who's the bro? gay ass dude? Who's yeah. like, Yo, you want to be a cute enough? <laughs> you want to be second man head? You want to be second man head? <laughs> it's like, like, hey, hey, do a quick work that, work that. Yeah, yeah, bro, you see what yeah, yeah, He was like, damn, you pretty, motherfucker. You got hella friends. You had you had to fucking put on your best fresh ass outfit, bro. And like, if you're fresh, you get in. What was your name back in the day? I don't even know, bro. Ah, uh, uh, no. Uh, you know what I'm saying? No, Flaco. Ah, uh, uh, perro. Low key, I did. Flaco, uh, sticks in your thigh. Like back uh, then, I tried yeah. doing like a, a, a Facebook pretty boy page. Yeah. And it was like, sa, smiley face, l. <laughs> what? <laughs> Because you know how like on the U, like if yeah. you like hold down the U, you get like the other option? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It was like two dots that made a smiley face. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, sad smiley face. Bro, I, I, I wonder what happened to all the people that had swag loading like in their fucking... Yeah. And then you think that shit loaded? Right they have here. a fucking podcast. Yeah. You think or that shit... <laughs> works, at the, works at the Krusty Krash. Shut your fat ass up, bitch. You gonna get fired the first day eating all them damn burgers. Location, Narnia. Warehouse and shit. Huh? Probably work at a warehouse. That's fine. Hey, the Amazon <laughs> warehouse. Oh my god, bro! That's <laughs> crazy, bro. Yeah, bro. We're not IE, bro. Work there no more. If, fuck hey, but he's not bro. talking about forklift. My bad, not We're not IE. Not forklift certified. I just quit certified. a month ago, bro. Fuck. You looking at? Hey, you looking uh, at a yeah. fellow truck hey, driver, Beto? Oh, okay. oh, absolutely. Forklift right. certified? Oh yeah. You bro. drive the Reach, bro. Drive the Reach? He's not. He's not cherry. Hey, you not gonna dab him up, Gazelle? He's not cherry picking. Hey, bro. Come on, G. He's not I don't, I, don't, I, didn't, I didn't even drive the <laughs> I drove the regular ass sit down. Hey, I drove the reach. Uh, <laughs> I drove oh, the reach. Beto's in the back, by the way. Beto's in the back. He's in the back. Yeah. On the ones and twos. Yeah. Who's the truck driver? Ah, Rex. Mr. Retired, though. Damn. Retired over here. You ever kill a family? Fuck. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> A family? Nah, bro. Nah, 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 nah. Thank I mean, God. You been in car accidents like that? Yeah, I've been in a big accident, but nah, I didn't kill no one. I sent some of them. You beat the case, bro. You That's what I'm talking about. Hey, it's not close. Close. Hey, they hospital, close. They didn't close. They didn't close. They didn't close. Shit, shit. Yeah, yeah. Nah, For real? You, you got in a... You yeah, crashed? No, yeah, I got in an accident. <laughs> I killed the lost my life. Um, I was in an accident. I was probably said, what, 2019? I was driving in the snow. I was going like 30 miles per hour. That's it. I fucking hit up. I was smashing it in the snow. That's crazy. Yeah, that, that's the that's snow. the limit yeah, of where your truck can go. I fucking hit the mobile home because it was like, oh. I fucking have no lights, you know? Ugh, yeah. And I fucking just sent that fool out of the freeway. Fuck. His shit flipped like, like fucking Ben Diesel on, you know, Fast and Furious. Oh, he's good then. Doom, 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 doom. Yeah. Oh, My shit, shit just fucking, you know, I had like oversized pipes in the trailer. They just yeah. go like almost in the truck. But oh, shit. And I had a concussion. That could have killed you, bro. Yeah, it killed me. Bro. But you know the fucked up part of, of everything? This who sent us. This is how fucking bad friends we are. This who sent us a picture. He was in the hospital, right, with a fucking neck brace. Yeah, and we're like, yeah, damn, yeah. you look fucking stupid, bro. <laughs> <laughs> instead, That's crazy, bro. Instead of being like, hey, bro, you good? Bro, bro I almost we're... died. And motherfuckers pulled out jokes. <laughs> hey, so so you're saying, not making look. it to the pod today or what? Yeah, I'm, sending, I'm sending like an update like, damn, bro, I just got an accident. Look at me. You know, I almost yeah. lost my life. And motherfuckers trying to be like, a pick me. you look ugly, bro. <laughs> you look ugly. That, was, that was his contact picture for like two years. <laughs> But his neck brace. You put your whole wristband uh, on the fucking grandma yeah. on the IG story. The homie's paying on the downfall, huh? <laughs> did you, did you break crazy. your neck or something or what? Yeah, what I had a it? concussion and like they just fucking sent me, to, you know, I got oh, an ambulance okay. sent me to the hospital. Wait, 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 in, wait. in the big rig, right? Yeah. You, you got an accident. Bro, and you still hit him that hard that you fucking, your and neck. You got a good yeah, crazy, bro. Blast, blah. Uh, that shit just fucked me up. Why did it happen? What happened? Uh, well, the, you know, I crashed because the mobile home didn't have no lights. So I was just, it's just like, so you know, just snowing, it's raining. Did you get so a I check? I didn't see anything. Did you get a check? Nah, he ended up, well, my insurance covered it and he ended up, I think he got over 100K. God! It's still yo, the driver's fault. Hey, yo, hit my shit the, real quick. Oh, yeah, yeah, the people in the back. It's always people in the back. It's always yeah, the truck yeah, driver's yeah, yeah. fault. But uh, thank hit, God I didn't get arrested or anything. Hit me, that fool did end up to the hospital. What's it, what, what, uh, he had a, what city? What city? It was in Utah. That fool had a hole, went like, like almost in, like it pretty much stabbed him and threw him. Yeah, shit. Yeah. Oh, oh, he probably okay. deserved the hundreds and shit. Oh, yeah. I think yeah, he, I think he deserved the million, yeah. but a yeah. hundred from my boy is not that bad. He might have deserved to get hit, yeah. to be honest, bro. Low key yeah. could have been a bad person. <laughs> yeah, if you really oh, think about no. it. That, yeah, that shit went on your record as a preventable accident. 
Yeah, it did, but I cleared it out. I'm cool though. That's right. <laughs> I cleared it out. Did Not that gonna... shit traumatize you? Like when Fuck you, were, yeah, hell you yeah. were like on the road with a normal one. Fuck you were like, yeah, bro. That shit you... traumatized me for like what, like I could say two years. I could say. Fuck. Fuck that. I never went back to carrying those like oversight pipes. Because if those pipes wouldn't when like in the truck, I would have, I would have been. You killed them. Yeah. No, no I, I would have been killed. I would have been sliced. Oh, oh, sliced on you too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pipes. Yeah, but yeah, like yeah. Rex would have been shit. extinct. Yeah, uh, we're not damn. damn, the last living Rex is <laughs> crazy. Yeah. I can't even imagine. Oh, Joe, that's crazy. That's crazy. What up? That's made bueno bueno without Rex. That's, that's bars. That was though. a dad joke. <laughs> yeah, that was bars. That was bars. Yeah. 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 That's that's joke. Good. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> but that, you always hear about that shit, like um, like brake failure on on like truck yeah. drivers and shit. Yeah. Yeah. I'm always like, fuck, bro, don't drive in front of trucks, dog. Bro, like, my I, dad's in a huge lawsuit right now. That's what's your pops. Yeah, because his brakes failed in his truck, so he's uh. He's uh he's doing this huge lawsuit against JBO. Damn. Oh, oh, he, he, he got hit. John Brash. No, uh, no, it was uh <laughs> his his yeah, yeah. Not, his truck got like malfunctioned because they didn't check that shit right. So um in a like oh, in a couple months I'm gonna be living in the island. <laughs> Oh, oh, I'm leaving the podcast. That's a million dollar yeah. check. Yeah, I'm leaving the podcast. Oh, yeah. Hey, <laughs> hey, let me get let me get one of them speakers when you get when yeah, you yeah, settle. Yeah. You going to the hill? Nah, no, he's gonna Go hand to it over hills. to me. We we talked about it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's just, uh, I might just get married to this. Fool, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Check. Good. Wife, though. nah, yeah, but fuck that, bro. That's, that final destination shit. That's just so yeah. scary. Yeah. Fuck, hell man. yeah. Oh, I still don't drive behind like yeah. I still don't drink wood or anything like that. I still don't drink water bottles in the car because of that fucking fuck water bottles in the car, bro. I still don't drink and drive. I, uh, no, I do. Nah, I don't think drive a little. Part. Nah, the water bottle one is so true because yeah. that's I, I've seen that like happen to me. I was like, oh shit. Which one? Which? Oh, when the yeah, water bottle yeah. slips. That's the third one. It's like I think when the final it stops the brake. Two or three, yeah. Yeah. When like yeah, the water bottle slips under the brake and he's trying to brake and he can't because the water bottle's in the way. I gotta fuck go look that. at my shit right yeah, now. What the fuck? <laughs> you guys recycling or what? Like. No, well, you know, no, never bottles in the car. You don't, you don't, sometimes you drink a water bottle, you don't even finish it all. You sometimes just take a piss in the back bottle. there. And then it's, oh, it's, and too, it rolls, it's oh. too old to drink, bro. You're just like, oh, I'm not going to drink this shit. But it stays <laughs> hey, back there. Yeah. When I almost got into an accident, bro, I was like 19 years old, bro. We went to the strip club at the time in, in Tijuana. That's right. Some light. Yeah, some Sound light. Like it was light right? Hong Kong or what? It was. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Adelitas. Oh, it's a classic. Yeah, it was back, you know, I was 19 years old. Went with some homies. It was a. Uh, five of us so three in the back and then two in the front right yeah and my boy was driving and i was in the back on the right side and then my one of my boys in the middle and then the other dude was in the back sleeping on the left side you know how guys are bro a car yeah. fucking passed us it's like, hey fool don't let that fool fucking don't let him beat you bro. <laughs> don't let him fucking beat you you a bitch my just, homie fucking, you just got bitched boom, dog. <laughs> fucking floored that shit bro he yeah. floored it we started reach we passed him we reached like one 145, 150. What the so fuck? Some light. Nah. Some trying to break light. the sound some barrier. Crazy. Oh, some <laughs> light, some Breaking light. Breaking the sound barrier. Who said that? <laughs> Out of nowhere, bro. We're like, we reached 145, bro. And like, we hit a fucking dip on the freeway. And we bounced twice. Boop. Nah. Boop. And we started spinning out. Oh, fuck. In that and, moment, you're like, fuck, In that I'm moment, dead. I was like, damn, we're going to flip over. Like, we're, we're fucked. Yeah. So I grabbed myself to the fucking handle up here. And I closed my eyes, bro. And now I remember I opened them. And we're like facing the center divider. And I was like, oh, and I fucking oh. just clinched my jaw, bro. I went like this. And then I don't know where the car stopped. And we're like in the middle of the freeway. Fuck. And I was like, fuck. Gosh. And like my homie just like, you know, he drove on, on the side of the freeway. We got out of the car. We started fucking praying. Damn. We're like, bro. Dude, the next day we all went to church. <laughs> <laughs> as you should. As you bro, should. Thank yeah. God, bro. But yeah, that was damn. a crazy one, bro. That was like the one that I was like, damn, never again. No, yeah. I, know, I know what you're talking about though that feeling where you're just like right when you're about to crash and you just like clinch yeah, and you're just like it almost like in slow motion and shit yeah. just and honestly like in your head you're like oh I'm about to die right now yeah. like that's well, literally what the, the thought in your head bro I was like damn what have I done am I going to hell like fuck I did this <laughs> shit last week like you know like yeah. I beat my shit last week uh, uh, hey but that's why my biggest I can't fall asleep when someone else is driving oh nah yeah, I can't bro that. cause nah. the shit like that like I can't yeah. like I I no matter how tired I am, like I have to stay up. Bro, imagine you wake up and you're in hell. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's fun. Just, oh. <laughs> I didn't even do anything. Oh, oh, what's, what's, up, what's up, what's Saddam? Wait, what's the, the heater on? What the fuck? Why is this so What hot? the fuck did I do, bro? Like, <laughs> That would be crazy, bro. Yeah. Imagine that shit. Oh, that, I don't <laughs> want to imagine that shit. Your boy that that was driving went up to heaven though. He's like, you, yeah. can't even come, you can't even confront oh. him. I bro. didn't get enough time to fucking yeah. no fuck up. Uh, yeah. Bro, yeah. come on, man, help me out. Yeah. What the fuck? fuck? And you dab him up like, hey, bro, hey, bro, yeah. it's a fucking demon. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> You're good. Don't even I've never even thought yeah. about that like, shit though. Like, yeah, bro, that'll be fucking. I'll be scary, bro. There's gotta be a library in hell though. Oh, hell <laughs> a library? Yeah. yeah there's if there's cool. a library, I'll be cool. I'm <laughs> but they, but you got a card and it's cash only. <laughs> oh, nah, that's the real hell. And that's there's no the ATM. Hey, hey, I got oh, cash today. Fuck? That's Dude. real hell right there. <laughs> I found cash in my pocket oh, when, I, when I put them on. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hey, <laughs> Sometimes I do that on purpose. I leave cash in my pockets just to find it later. Oh, he's that type. Like an Easter egg. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm like, like oh, oh it's cold, bro. I'm like, oh shit. How'd it go? He's that type. Yeah. All right, y'all, we interrupt this episode to bring you our brand new sponsor, SeatGeek. And uh, yeah, today's video is sponsored by SeatGeek, like I, we all just fucking Let's said. Let's go, SeatGeek. Thank you, I'm Seek very Geek. excited about this partnership. Hell yeah. Too. With over 28 million downloads, SeatGeek is, no <laughs> <laughs> is the number one ticketing app. There are more than uh, 70,000 events every single day. No. Oh, back, 70,000? Including concerts, sports, festivals, back. and more. What? Uh, I, I just went to a game. Yeah, I literally just went to a game. Shout out to fucking SeatGeek. We use the code P-L-P. And you got $20 off our first That's order. That's a steal! It is a steal. <laughs> That's a steal! Uh, they fucking make it easy for you. They put all the tickets across the web in one place to make sure you are getting a good deal. Each ticket... Each ticket is rated on a scale of one to ten, one through ten. So, so look for the green dots. Yes, sir. Yeah. Green means good, red means bad. Oh, that's true. Every ticket is backed by their buyer guarantee, and SeatGeek is the only site that lets you return your tickets ahead of the event with swaps. That's fine. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. With swaps. Yep. And you know we came through for y'all. Use the code P L P for twenty dollars off the ticket. Twenty dollars. <laughs> that's twenty dollars off your uh, first purchase. First purchase with a uh, promo code P L P Seat Geek and uh yeah we want to yeah. thank you we want to thank you uh Seat Geek thank much. you Seat Geek we're excited about this partnership and thank you guys for sponsoring the episode yes sir now let's get back to the episode right shit for the people who fucking don't know let them know what's like what's up with y'all like what y'all be doing in podcasting and how you guys are, like what you guys were up to so they ain't all that I know, yeah, like, I know they do yeah, yeah, yeah. no it's people it's people they, they I always said like we call people so like we have a uh, we call. And uh, we give good advice, and sometimes we give bad advice, as people yeah. as people have seen. It's better to we give get, bad advice, get, though. Get, like, <coughs> honestly, it's, see it's the comments? in the middle of, like, toxic and bad and then good. Well, the yeah, thing yeah. is, like, we know. Like, we have, like, a switch. Like, whenever, like, it's someone that needs, like, help, yeah. we're like, all right, like, all right, let's be serious. Yeah. But then when it's people where it's like, oh, this caller's going to be boring, let's be toxic. <laughs> and that happened last <laughs> week, bro. We yeah. had a caller. She was obviously in the Justice right. for caller number one. Yeah, justice yeah. for her. That's man. all the comments. Shout <laughs> out. Bro, everyone people were mad at us, us bro. Yeah. It was a, bra it was a brazy. Wow. Happened. Was that was the closest to us getting canceled. The one with brazy? The last episode, yeah. The one where you guys attacked the caller? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Nah, Damn, and why honestly, you say it like that. They deserve nah, it. Bro. Honestly, I'm, I'm a, hey, justice it, for caller number one. No, no, we 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 did. No, we attacked wait, it. Yeah, this, right, this let is me, the, let me, let me analyze it. This is the thing. Look, we 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 tell people like, do not take us serious. Nah, they we're not professional therapists yeah. at all. Close. So we we like to say things and we fuck around. We like to be toxic. They know we're toxic. We like to say stupid shit all the time. Mm -hmm. And this caller, yeah, she didn't deserve it because she was saying she was in the right. She was so nice. But we're just like, bro, like that's boring. Like I want, <laughs> like, I, want I want to fucking get toxic. Nah, I, nah, yeah. I think what it was, I think we were really saying what we were saying, but it's just the toxicity, all the testosterone was in the air. Yeah. That we're like, ah, oh, yeah, we're all wrong. <laughs> can, can, can I be honest? What fucked you guys over is like not one of you went on her side. I if, was trying if to. If only one went on your side, like, I know. But hard, hard yeah, went on your yeah. side. I was. Uh, you guys would have been safe. Right? Yeah, because I was. Scared then you don't look like an Andrew Tate podcast. Where no, yeah, it was yeah, an Andrew Tate podcast. women yeah. hating. I agree with you, I bro. Agree. But, That's just crazy. but uh, I think I was trying to get in her head because there was something that was missing. Yeah. I know, but and you like, ran away with the first one. I was one, trying to get in her head, but I was joking. But it's like I've learned that some people call us, but it's like you got to know who you're calling. Yeah. yeah like if I call the chocolata. <laughs> I, know story, I know they're gonna roast random me. shit out. <laughs> like, hey Rex, even if I say my girl cheated on me, I yeah. know by the end of the call they're gonna roast me. Let me, me let me interrupt you real quick, bro. Like I, I want to know the context of the of the call. Yeah, yeah. And like how yeah. Well, well, for the, people, the people yeah. don't so know. So what yeah, happened? Yeah, yeah. What happened? This girl said she was uh, dating her like boyfriend. I, I think of three years, and she got a really good job opportunity to move like different states. And um, she said her man decided to leave everything to go with her and um so she really loved this guy like she loved she tried her best with this dude 
but when she when they moved and everything he just got like super depressed and she got really she was upset that she was that he was watching a lot of porn uh, and i think that was what triggered us not gonna lie yeah like, oh yeah. you're mad because he's watching porn he's jerking yeah. off so i think that's what bigger titties bitch yeah so like, yeah. okay so, <laughs> so it's basically hey, justice, hey, justice, hey, justice, yeah. justice for calling no, one justice for Car- man but she did try hey, if you're down in the comments below Fuck caller number one, dog. <laughs> Put it down there in the comments. Fuck caller number one, bro. Yeah, don't, don't talk about our porn, all right? That's facts, bro. That's Attack our me. escape. That's our escape. So and that's, that's basically what happened. We, and basically uh, what happened, and I think people just look at us and be like, oh, you guys are hurt because she was talking about porn. It's not that. I, I think we were questioning her because there was something missing there. Because mm-hmm. why would... She, she sounded too why perfect. Why would she call us for advice right. and then crying over her ex? Mm-hmm. But she wants our advice to get back with her ex because she missed them. Yeah. So there's there's some. I always say there's something there. I even told my girl there's something of there course. that she did not want to yeah. tell us. The girl came she, after they us. They always he say like there's, there's your side. You know what I'm saying? Like the yeah. three sides and yeah. shit. Yeah. 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 So it's like obviously she's telling her her side of the fucking yeah. story. So yeah. Because bro. that fool. The porn. Yeah. It, it isn't. It is something there. But that was weird. He got depressed. He lost his job. He missed his friends and family. So it's something there that sh- in the story that she did not want to Did say. she specify why he, uh, what, she how she found to. out she, how he got a porn addiction? She, uh, she, she, she moved, that he moved in with her, right? He moved away yeah, from, yeah, from yeah. all his friends yeah. to her or some shit like that, right? But the thing is, she even told him like, hey, like, if you want, we can go visit your friends. We can go back, yeah. you know, mm-hmm. for a week, two weeks, for vacation, whatever. But he didn't want to. Yeah, I think he was just being petty. So that's why I, I knew already, like, no, you're you're obviously right. Like, fuck mm-hmm. him. But in my head, I'm like, bro, like. That shit don't make good content. Like, I want to. <laughs> yeah. That's you know, a quick phone call right there. Like, hey, you're right. Our next know. caller. Yeah, they know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Our viewers know. Like, we like content. We like to create shit on, you know, make TikTok clips, Instagram. Yeah. So I was like. Eh. But I think what we did mess know. up in usually, because I say, like, a lot of bad advice on purpose. But then I always say like, nah, I'm, I'm playing. Like, yeah. listen to Hans. This one we didn't say we were playing. Yeah, yeah, we did. We didn't. We didn't say that. <laughs> I, I think that. that's where we fucked yeah, up. I think it's because it was implied, right? Like, if you're a if you're a a usual a usual listener of the show, it's implied that you guys are fucking around. Yeah, yeah. And you you this like a switch when you know like even like in the tone of voice uh-huh. when you know somebody's being like serious yeah, and yeah, shit. Yeah. Yeah. So like some people just aren't like. Socially aware, yeah, yeah, aware to even like hang on to that. Yeah, yeah. You know what's crazy that uh, our our uh, guest, uh, fucking breezy, white breezy, he was telling us, "Yeah, it's crazy, bro, because your even your own fans will switch up on you like that." Yeah. He said that on the fucking episode, right? And then look what happened. Yeah, yeah. The comments are <laughs> not like fishing really for that. I don't no. think they yeah. switched up. I think they uh, they they were mad. Because this is what I say. I, I was like, we cook, but we also burn. Hey, but also mm. my girl too. She like she put wood on the fucking fire. Your girl started. I had to check. I'm like, hey, she, yo. Start, she started the <laughs> gas. Yeah, she started that shit. And I'm that, like, let's show. I'm like, watch on your episode. I'm gonna start some shit too. Yeah, she texted yeah. me. She like, was like, hey, I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna say some shit. Uh, don't take it the wrong way, but I'm that's okay. Nah, I took it the wrong way. I didn't even know what was going on. Until I saw the Instagram. I got oh yeah, some girl, or... some girl left a comment on our IG saying, um, "If you um, something, but I think I screenshot it. It was like, oh, uh, just admit you're wrong that you're deleting comments. No, or she's like, oh, she's mm. like, it's crazy how you're deleting comments when you know you're wrong. Like, get help. Soon. Yeah, yeah, get help. Boo hoo. I was bitch. like, what the fuck? <laughs> Boo hoo. I just started hey, laughing. Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? What? <laughs> if it's under our fucking post, I'll do whatever the fuck I damn well please, bro. Oh, yeah, what are you talking de- about? Yeah. Deleting comments on your YouTube videos because they call you out on your BS is crazy. Get help soon. Mm. But, you but, get, the way, subscribe. Oh my. This comes with a <laughs> lesson. This comes with a lesson. All right. What, this comes with what's the lesson. What's the lesson? The lesson is as like social media personnel, we are a business, mm. right? So, like, let's say you see, if you go on Yelp, and you mm. see someone leaves a bad review, the owner is okay. always going to say something good back. Like, okay. hey, I'm sorry about your experience. Yeah. How, what can we do to fix it? So I did that. I replied with her like that. I'm like, hey, I'm so sorry. Um, I didn't. I wasn't aware of this. I think YouTube's filtering words. And she's like, oh, you know what? Yeah, I did use some bad words. Let me try again. And it worked. <laughs> and I, she was like, oh, thank you so much. And I'm like, I love you. Yeah. And then she followed me. Yeah, bro. A so, lot of people just and, and, it's, and, and, and then he fucked. That, and then he yeah. fucked. And then I fucked. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I was gonna hit that. <laughs> and I hit it. Yeah, and then he's gonna hit it. So we got it's just a business at the end of the day. I think yeah. my problem with sometimes with questions when you ask fans for shit is a lot of them already know the answer to the problem that they have. Yeah. That's my biggest fucking issue with a lot of these yeah. Yeah. these dumbass <laughs> bitches out there. <laughs> 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 no, no. Our callers just like to they they our callers are masochists. Like they player. want us to like smack them around and talk shit. They yeah. love that shit. Yeah, they yeah. love that shit. They love when we do that too, but then it's like some Sometimes it's like, oh, like we get those people that like, you guys never answered the question. I'm like, bro, because a lot of times you guys already know 
what you're you're supposed to hear you just want us or they know that they're right and they just want him to be like oh yeah you're right bro. dog some dude Shut left up, up bro some dude called us one time and he's like yeah bro this girl always uh she she tells me weird things when we have sex and i was expecting <laughs> some weird shit yeah. yeah and then when i was like oh so what's the weird shit oh that i have a big dick and then yeah. I'm like, that's okay. so weird. Oh, that's so weird. I was like, oh, oh, that's so crazy. I hate when that happens. I, like that wasn't for well, show. I think some of them they, they just want attention. Yeah, they just want validation. Brag. Yeah, mm-hmm. but it's I love, like I love it though. Keep it coming. Yeah. Or, they or, they, wanna, or they want you to agree with the dumb shit they want to do. Yeah, yeah. Or they that's a lot of it too. It's a lot yeah. of it. Just like yeah. should I should I get back? Should I be friends with my ex even though I miss him? Shut even even up, though we bro. ended on bad terms and he wants to he wants to hang out with me, should I call him again? What the fuck you think, dumb bitch? But I think yeah. as, sometimes people need that friend that just like puts that reality check because everybody's Delulu, you know. Yeah. yeah. Everybody's had their Delulu stage where you're like love li- love blinds you. Yeah. So you need someone to be like, like nah, hey. she don't mean the restraining order, bro. She didn't mean it. It's <laughs> well, fine. Well, that's well, that's, well, that's where the reality you. of your show comes into play, though. <laughs> yeah. Because as much as rough as some of the fucking answers that you guys give it is, that's the truth. Yeah, it's a reality. It's check. the reality. And some again, somebody has to go to the other side and play fucking Someone's oh, aguacate del diablo. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so somebody has to do that shit. Yeah. So it's like, yeah, I would. You know? say, usually that that dynamic, it, that's how it is. Is Hans is usually we call him honest Hans. He's the mm. one that like He's, he says reality check. Yeah. Rex is the one that like he I'm, finds a different perspective. Like, wait, what about this? Yeah. And then I'm the one that's like kind of puts it together. I'm fuck like, shit. Nah, yeah, yeah, that yeah. was toxic. As flash, fuck flash, fuck yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah toxic. And then toxic. Toxic. I'll wrap it together. And if she like, if she's bad, like her voice, like he's like, oh, yeah. my head, like me. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I like that I've noticed that uh, Rex does on a few calls. You he's, noticed? he's been like, <laughs> yeah, he's a good. You know yeah. he's an average, he's it's like, like, he's like an average listener. <laughs> nah, nah, it's a good thing. I'm saying like, I've, I've noticed when like sometimes you guys will, uh, uh, Saul and Hans will be a little bit like coddle the the whoever's calling in, mm-hmm. and Rex will be like, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> like, he's, like, he's that like the what's the de- like you said earlier? Yeah, like, like, what's like that detail like, missing. He's like, there's something you're not saying. Like he does that pretty often. Where he's like. I don't know. Like, what? Are you, <laughs> yeah, what are you doing? Yeah, like, cause, cause, yeah, but how many times does that work for you though? Like, you know, when you say it to people, and then like, all right, well, I'm missing kind of this. Yeah, because I, I usually the truth comes out. You just gotta put get it out of them. Yeah. Yeah. Like, oh well, it's because I did this, but I didn't want to say. It. You know, uh, I, I got that. See, bitch, yeah. that you're wrong. Get, like I said, they just need validation, so they gotta lie on the on the call. Yeah, yeah. Kind of be like, oh, who gets tore up the most? Uh, the conversation. Hans? Why really? Would, why, why does? Why would? And you're the one being torn? honest. I don't think so. Honest, Hans gets, gets torn I, up the most. I think Saul does. I think I do get torn up the yeah. most because yeah. I, I, I mean I purposely say toxic shit. So yeah. Who gets I, torn up uh, the worst though? You he, he, you? you're the same. Uh, this by the way, he does the same shit. Which is, so, it's because it's, it's funny, bro. That shit's entertaining, and it's also not real. And if you want to come, you come down to two fuck. Fi- <laughs> <laughs> <Imagine. laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll be real because like you knew you do need that. Like you also need like the. Like, you need do, you just need different for perspectives. Yeah. Like, if, if, if it was just me and Lalo, huh? yeah, like, good. oh yeah, somebody's cooking yeah. something. Uh, yeah. Rick's got yeah, it's a boring podcast. Everybody agrees. Yeah, bro. Like, oh, if yeah, it was yeah. just me, I thought Lalo, it was my it'd be boring. But like, this fool <laughs> just say some crazy shit out of nowhere. You'll be like, ah, right, hell yeah. Like, yeah. let's make this. this bro, spice we'll, this shit we'll up. coddle the 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 person who asked the question. We're like, nah, it's cool. Like, work on yourself. Be like, honestly, you're. And this will come in. You're probably just fucking fat. That's true. And it's just like, God, you're probably hey, a terrible. Hey, yo, yo. But whoa. also, you might be a terrible person, bro. Let's be for real. I don't yeah. know these people. Yeah. Like, they, we're only getting like how you guys have said. Like, we're only getting their perspective yeah, of the yeah, situation. Yeah. And, and let's be real. Like, let's say we, because we get DMs, we do the DMs and shit. Like uh-huh. sometimes people ask for advice, so you guys actually call like physically. Yeah. And but we're always kind of always gonna side with like whoever is like writing in or calling our in, listener you know? like you're yeah, always cause they are they're our supporters at the end Duh, of the day like, yeah, yeah. so like or even the ones- if they're wrong you still let them down easy you're yeah, yeah, like yeah. Yeah. you know nah, Hans Hans calls them me. stupid there's a thing there's a thing and you know we love our fans bro honestly shout out to our fans it's a toxic relationship they're great yeah we're it's a toxic relationship with us well it's only toxic now (laughs) right now (laughs) at this moment nah you're good but I've always told them I was like you know what like I think like I always tell them like they want honest Hans because I'm gonna tell you like a big brother yeah. Like I'm gonna tell you how it is. Yeah. Like I love you, but you're fucking being stupid. Yeah. Right and, now. and I'm gonna tell you like the boyfriend who's trying to give you good advice because he's trying to fuck. Yeah. yeah. Uh, or the best friend. Yeah. yeah. The best friend. The yeah. Best friend. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm gonna yeah. roast you and then agree with you. And then just <laughs> drive into a family of four. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Find someone back, ask y'all. Because you guys have gotten a fucking. Well, you guys will do like two, two, two to three calls a week, right? Yeah. Yeah. What's like the craziest one that you've been like? Oh shit! This one stands out. Oh, remember when that girl got kidnapped? 
Oh, oh shit. yeah. Same yeah, way. yeah. Some girl got kidnapped. What the fuck? Yeah, no, yeah. we're like, like, what the fuck are you doing calling us, bitch? Call the police. What the fuck? You know? Yeah, she went on a date and um, she, uh, this guy, uh, basic, I, they didn't hit it off. And then the guy was like, so you don't like me, huh? And then she was like, um, I don't know. And then he just didn't want to take her home. And he was like, dr- he drove on the opposite side of the freeway. Yeah. Like, oh, it was like this whole shit. dilemma. He's like, I'm going to kill us type shit. Yeah, I'm going to kill us type shit. Weird, shit. And then they, some shit. Even at the gas station, he put up, because he ran out of gas. No. And then she's like, I'll pay, like, I'll pay for the gas. And then um, he locked the door so she couldn't even leave from the gas station. Yeah. What? Was, yeah, she was crazy. Which I don't get, because... I would have yeah, kunk. He probably had the if trial lock. If on. And if you're in the front seat, you, uh, they are open, right? Yeah, the yeah front yeah. seat's open all the time. Even if you lock it. Yeah. So not, not if that, that fool had that shit modified. No. <laughs> not <laughs> if he had that before. Yeah. That yeah. doesn't sound like his first rodeo. Yeah. Yeah. Being for real. Nah, but yeah, that, that one was one of those, like damn. We asked him. We had like we had this one girl in particular. Oh, pizza parlor. Pizza parlor. <laughs> Pepper, no, what's it? Uh, Pe- Peter Piper. Peter Piper Pizza Parlor Parking Lot Bra. Yeah. Damn. The, yeah. Bro, I, so this girl, she incriminated <laughs> herself so many times. We had to like cut some shit off. Yeah, man. yeah. I got but like, gel. She oh. she's gonna gel. <laughs> bro, that's gel. <laughs> she's saying gel. gel shit. Damn. Like, gonna gel. Yeah. By the way, we've had like tech uh, DMs like that when we ask like a, a prompt or something, yeah. and then some guys will say some shit, and it's just like you. They never stick to the prompt. It'd be like, "What's your favorite Halloween costume?" So it's one time I hit this bitch, and it's like, "What the <laughs> fuck, bro?" Like, I, I picked up this girl I was 14 I was 18 at the time I was like We oh, cannot What, you, what the fuck are you doing yeah. We cannot Why the fuck would you admit that to us like, yeah. We're not your friends Send shit to the cop Yeah, yeah like, do, you, do, you have, do, you, do you have a lot of siblings? Just one One brother Just one And is it older? Or uh, older He's 32 Oh that's weird Cause it's weird that you kind of like Have that perspective Of being like the older brother like Me? To, the, to people Like like ran yeah, I don't know, bro. Honestly, I think is that why though? Cause, cause you wanted to be an older brother or somebody. Oh. Yeah, was he not enough? He you? wasn't yeah. enough, dude. He we bullied me crying. when I was growing up. <laughs> Shout out to Toast. Shout out to. We're about to have a sad time, bro. The music, nah, the music. I don't, I don't know, bro. Honestly, I don't know. Like, I think. I grew, oh, oh I, do you want to hear shit like that? I grew you? up. I grew up too fast. Like, I grew uh, up wanting to be like my brother. Uh, no, I uh, don't be mad. Don't be mad. <laughs> I don't know. There's hey. a detail he's missing. Don't be mad. You don't know what he's missing. This hey, he, didn't grow, he didn't grow up with a brother. He's hey, this was doing taxes by fifteen. <laughs> <laughs> nah, bro, I did. I, I grew up way too. F- how much? <laughs> how much older was he than you? Boy, he's six years older than me. Okay, that's a big. That's, that's a, a big difference. difference, bro. He like. So you're just seeing him grow up, bro. Like, when, when I was in, in a, elementary school, yeah. this fool was fucking smoking weed, fucking doing God knows what, bro. I was a kid, I didn't know. Yeah. yeah. But I remember he used to smoke weed, a lot of weed, bro. And I remember one time they were in my room, mm-hmm. him and his homie, and this fool was fucking. I'm a, no one knows my brother's name, whatever. The, they were rolling up weed when they put coke in that shit. Oh shit. Uh-huh. Or at like, least I thought it was coke. Maybe it was crystal. I don't know, but uh, fool, yeah. they, 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 they were they were on that yeah. crazy shit back then, bro. That's when that drug shit was like. And you and you were just vibing. In the I room? was just vibing. I didn't care. I was just fucking playing my Nintendo. But but you yeah. saw you peeped down the corner. Yeah. And then when I as soon as I got like in what fifth grade, I started smoking a cigarette. Like I tried yeah. it for the first time, and I was yeah. like, "This is nasty." Yeah. But then I got to middle school and I started drinking beer. Oh uh, okay. So I feel like I grew up compared to everybody else in middle mm-hmm. school. Like these fools are probably fucking doing other stuff, but I was like drinking in middle school. Damn. Oh shit! Okay. And I was nauseating. That sounds kind of normal. Sounds illegal. Yeah. I, no, no, uh, but it middle, depends what level. A little. It depends what level of drinking. Because if you're drinking, like, yeah, I'm getting fucked up. Well, every weekend, like, every weekend I'd go out. Like, my parents, like, oh, no, a las doce te voy a recoger. Yeah. My dad, right? So I, I was like, all right, well, I'm going to get dropped off the fucking party at 8 p.m. Mm-hmm. And 8 p.m., I'm going to get drunk until fucking 10 so I can sober for two hours. So mm-hmm. between eight to ten, I just get fucking fucked. Fuck. This one had Jaeger on the rocks, <laughs> <laughs> no. getting martinis, and that's what fucking he was getting started. those Hulks. What are those just called? The, the, the Incredible Hulks. The Incredible Hulks. <laughs> <Hulk? laughs> <laughs> that is that. That. He's getting down. Yeah, but, but yeah, I mean, that, I I fucking that's why I was like, I grew up way too fast, bro. Damn. Yeah, but it was after yeah. chasing like your brother, no? Yeah, I was wanted. To, I wanted to be like my brother. Like, oh, yeah, I want to do that. I want to do. Yeah, that. It was cool to you. Yeah. Yeah. He's your, he's your I mean, role model. Like this fool was the old. He was the only boy fool in his family. So like. Boy, of course, <laughs> he's the man, you bro. Had, my bad, bro. Man, you, you, grow, you grow up uh, fast too, huh? How many you know, siblings me out there? I can't say man. How many siblings do you live? I got uh, just my sister, hey, but she didn't live with us. Oh, just your sister? Yeah, my sister moved out. She was like fifteen, so I was oh. just like, it was just me by myself, dugging it out. You know? You think the reason why you're always kind of like, hold on, real quick, is because mm. you know how girls are. In the sense that they leave out shit like that, uh, like important details. Probably. I'm trying to break you down, man. Bro. What's up? <laughs> yeah, bro. I'm trying to. <laughs> hey, thanks, bro. We need the clip. Hey, it's not your fault. And hey, let's take a fucking fault. shot. Uh, yeah, bro. Oh, I'm always 
Let's take a shot. Let's, Let's get sad shot. and take shots. Lalo? What's up? Let me go first or what? Wait, Hans, I kind of want to know a little bit about that relationship, though, with your with your brother. Like, how's he doing today? You uh, want to cry, huh? Damn, bro. You uh, want to uh, uh, Get in his head. Nice. It's just an interesting fucking... Yeah. It's a deep question, bro. I, never, I don't really talk about my... <laughs> no, I don't talk about my brother. No, no, no. Yeah, if, if it's too much, it's cool. No, I mean, nah, I'm good. I, I, he's, he's just. He, I, I just drink one. I fought around. You don't yeah. take a shot? Nah, you're good. You're, no, good, you're, you're good. good. Okay, look, look, look. Uh, yeah, you're good. I'm going to say your name on the podcast. Plus, <laughs> if, if we're, you say some sentimental shit, these was over here. I know, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, he's opening up. Yeah. He's, he's not, opening up here. Like, like, you know what? Take a shot. Take yeah. yeah. a shot. Was it down, fool? Wait, I didn't see. You took one? Yeah, he took a shot. Yeah. He didn't. He didn't, bro. Yeah. They're good. He was really opening up. I might never come. That's why I'm trying to pay attention. I'm going to be like. Connect we, with yeah, him. He'll be back next week. Good. Rex doesn't like when Hans has attention. Pour me a shot. No, like, <laughs> he don't. He cuts me off all the yeah, time. Yeah, Rex doesn't like when Hans Rex, gets attention. For real? I talk to like, <laughs> <laughs> Well, I could definitely tell, like, uh, well, also on the podcast, you guys have mentioned it before, like, you two were hanging out before even, like, when a bueno became a thing, right? Oh, yeah, being Rex. Yeah, as a homie. That's, yeah, that's the Mongolo. So where, where did that friendship start? Mongolo. I was a, fr- Damn, I, I was man, a freshman. Too. Fucking culero. <laughs> <laughs> This is caught you Mongolo. You let it ride. <laughs> it's so nah, normal, it's bro. Like, it's so normal. Well, We're just saying that shit all the time. On, I know y'all, you guys with y'all homies, like y'all, y'all be talking. <sighs> nah, that's Same, well, chill. Terrible. We're yeah. chill. Nah, I know. Like you, you, you guys, call, hey, bitch. Like yeah. I, I see you oh, guys yeah, say that yeah. to each other. Nah, not me. Bro, I call my girl, bitch. I don't know, bro. <laughs> that's because I love. Is her, it cariño? What were you saying? Yeah, what were you sentimental yeah. about? Yeah, was, what we no, no. I was asking about the relationship. Like, how did it come to be? Uh, mm. when did you meet they would say nice shit about you actually and you and cut him off Mongolo? Yeah. <laughs> when did you yeah. meet me I think well I was a freshman he was a sophomore Oh, that's cute oh, that's when I met this fool yeah. I'm telling you when I first met him cause, I, I, uh, was a, I was a pet prep no this fool no. <laughs> <laughs> what oh, what, what? what? Hey, hey, into, the, into I wanted the, to land a joke this fool was a pervert hey, into the mic bro <laughs> <laughs> into the mic yeah, into I'm the bad. camera yeah yeah I'm Chris Hansen I like him I'm gonna get him <laughs> I'm gonna get him. Yo, I'm gonna get him. Hey, nah, I think of my homie, what, Fernando brought you around? Shout or, out Fernando. Jose. I, think, I think Jose. Jose. So my homie Jose, shout out to Jose. Shout he brought crew. he brought him around. And I remember uh, when we first met him, I was like, oh, this was black. I thought he was black. I thought he was See, that's crazy. I yeah. thought he was the light fuck? skin. Like, can I say it? He's like, <laughs> no, yeah, can I say can it? Can I say it? Is it because you were saying it all the time? Or what? No, I just thought what if was... I rap it to my favorite rap song? <laughs> can I say it then? Like, he, does, he, he does say the N word all the time. Do I, so I think he's black. black? <laughs> oh, I don't know. I'm saying it. Don't black. take offense to it. God damn. Why are you so offended, bro? Lalo. What's up? You know him in high school. Yeah, I did. How did he look back then? He was dark. He was dark. Curly hair. He had a good joke. Yeah, he had curly hair. You know, he was like, when I. Yeah, short hair, but like, elbows. I, thought, I thought he was going to the league. Yeah, I thought, I thought, <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> what? Ashy, Ashy I thought he was going to the league, fool. I thought he was going oh, to the league. You said Ashy elbows, elbows Ashy lip. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ashy uh, elbows. Was, let right, the homie talk. Let the homie talk. <laughs> nah, I mean, yeah. I thought he was <laughs> black, fool. And then fucking, uh, he's like, oh no, I'm not black. I'm I'm Brazilian. And that's what this was said. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like for a whole a whole fucking year, we thought he was Brazilian, bro. That was beige. But I remember this one time, bro. The first time I met him, my homie Jose brought him to his house, right? And then my you know Fernando, my homie yeah. Fernando. Uh, yeah, we never met him. We never spoke to him. Nothing. This fool, he went inside my homie Jose's window, right, to look inside his house, to inside oh, his you room. Oh, you bitch! You gotta say that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, there was a big ass window, and this fool went like this, right, to look inside. <laughs> and then while he was like that, his ass was in the air. And my homie Fernando, he's like, I'm gonna put my finger in his ass. Uh, <laughs> and he did. He went, whoop. Like, hey, what's up, bro? <laughs> and the like, what the, <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? Who thought we were gay as fuck, bro? I remember that shit. <laughs> you know, think what? about it. You just start kicking with some new food. <laughs> and some yeah. new food just put a finger up there. What are you gonna do? Like, yeah, like yeah, you, yeah, you yeah, right, Rex? Yeah, you know, you know, right, 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 just right, met right. this for like 20 minutes ago. I already trying to figure that, that's out. How <laughs> to, but also, that's how the IE foods get around. Yeah. Uh, this food was. Oh, what? No. Hey, put that narrative out no, there. No, there's already a lot of on No, we just got to stick a finger in there. As homies, when you hold with homies, you do gay shit. And if you don't, if you say you don't, you're fucking lying. And this dude came from LA, LA, right? You came from LA, uh, so LA is like you touch my ass on beat your yeah, ass. Yeah, I was a little tough, but yeah, just, bro, I saw this fucking down. Gang you guys Rex? Me, like little, little, little. You little fruity, little fruity, you know? little sassy. If I don't touch your dick, you're not the homie, like, you know. <laughs> That's how we bond. <laughs> Let me see Hong Kong. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll do hey, got, hey, but y'all, 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 y'all converted him for sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's all gay now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We, we made him. We like it. You ever Hong Kong the homie? 
Oh, yeah. absolutely. Uh, good morning. <laughs> good morning. What the fuck? Hello. Are you up? You, know? like, you want to check me on fucking prostate? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you do it for us. You know, my, homie, my homie's scared of the doctor, fool. I got to do it myself. Yeah. I'm a real. How, how gay like are you guys? Like, between you what's the gay like, shit like, y'all the, done? Yeah, what's yeah. the gay or the kiss, jokes? This was kiss me. Yeah, yeah, kiss this one. Oh, he's kissing all of us pretty yeah, much. Yeah, I think, like we, I think everyone has dry hum- I I everyone has dry humped each other from the back. Mm-hmm. Well, you, I just dry humped him for a video. He dry humped me yeah. yesterday. Oh, yeah. yesterday. That's sick. Hell yeah. yeah. Fucking but, see, hey, but, by the way, I want to make it clear. This fool kiss me. I didn't ask for it. Nah, <laughs> <that's> <laughs> like, hey, 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 don't no, throw no, me no, under no. the bus, though. I'm I'm hey, hey, but I don't deal with consent well. Is that what you're trying to say? No, but also, like that just speaks on all of our. I'm gonna be real. Like that just speaks on all of our confidence. Like our our sexual. Like you know what? Were you drunk? Nah, I might be gay, bro. Me. I might be gay. Yeah. Caesar kissed me because we're drinking one yeah. time. You guys are not down to C- kiss? It kiss me. What? <laughs> Who's not down? What? <laughs> yeah, nah. nah Who's down, 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 down for Perrito? Bro, nah, with Hans, like, you know the game, like, or the Are You Nervous game? Uh, uh, nervous, yeah. He would yeah. not lose. Like, so he knows that like, no one's going to beat him, <laughs> yeah. but he met his match with Caesar. Yeah. And yeah. then Caesar, and that's where they, and that's how they end up kissing because they met each other's match. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Match made in heaven. And I, I put my finger in Rex's eyes the other day. Yeah. How did you feel, Rex? Like last week. Hey, Rex, you were crazy. Hey, you're married. Man, man like food? that shit went food. Yeah. Nah, bro, I swear to God, like, like I, was just, I was just fucking when I was like, "Hey, what's up? Like, what's up, food?" And I went, "Food." That shit went food. Yeah. <laughs> hey, but it's funny though, cause like when we do the soul, he don't like it because uh, he's serious. And I'll be yeah. telling Hans like, "Hey, get soul, get soul." Hey, but like Hans just goes behind soul like, "Hey, what's up?" <laughs> hey, what's up, baby girl? I'm squeamish. Hey, but God forbid we're, we're around our thieves and shit. Oh hell no, fuck no, no bro! Hey, get the fuck away from me, dog! <laughs> I'm my cheese as a Esas pinches jotadas que. I'll never Dio. do that shit in front of my Why are your jeans so tight? Why you got so many necklaces? Have you seen that gay uh, old Mexican fool that be dancing like Oh, uh, yeah, they do what they... He's got the crop. The crop. Yeah, he got the crop. Oh, like, yeah, like yeah, that. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's crazy. That fool looks good, bro. <laughs> fuck. He's living life for sure. He's living life. He's living his best life. Yeah, yeah, best, best all you do, you do that shit manually, huh? Hell yeah, yeah, I remember we. He's him, him, bro. That fool's working right now. He's on the ones and twos. I hope they pay you good. Fuck. You guys are fucking around. I'm all business, bro. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <laughs> we made your job hard today, huh? And how much they pay you? Enough, huh? Tell them. This, bro. <laughs> 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 Give him a job. You're like, he yeah. did it. Get him a job. <laughs> <laughs> Get him a job. Yo, you yeah, see yeah. what's going on? No, yeah, you see. We gotta suck his dick afterwards. Yeah. Don't fucking sign to him. Nah, you guys see what's going on with Meek Mill right now? Freak Mill? Yeah, Freak Mill. Yeah, Freak Mill. That shit's crazy. Nah, he's like, uh, basically, uh, Diddy took him shopping, like the whole thing that like, did, like, he's gay and shit. Like, they're doing all this freaky shit behind, mm. like, the scenes. It, isn't it crazy? Because they call him, um, he steals money. Yeah. He beats up women. He did it. Oh, but they cross the line when he's gay. He's like, oh, he's gay. They cross the line. They cross the line. What about the first shit he did, yeah. bro? <laughs> nah, he's gay, bro. They he's skip done. when he killed Biggie and Pog, but no, nah, he's gay. Like, nah. Oh, he's yeah. gay. Oh, what the fuck? No, nah, nah. fuck that. We letting that shit slide around here. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and so Meek, Meek Mill's getting treated. Yeah, he's getting. He's getting. Yeah. He's getting he's right. taking on shopping sprees. And Usher got molested when he was like eleven or ten. What the? Supposedly Justin Bieber did too. And if, oh yeah, 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 I heard yeah, about that. I heard, yeah, yeah. I heard about that. That's just yeah. crazy. Bro. I mean, think about it, bro. If someone like, like a 13, fucking billionaire came up to you right now and told I you, "Hey, first love. give me some fucking head." <laughs> I'll give him some fucking. <laughs> 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 I haven't even named the price. Uh, <laughs> I turned a chicken head, bro. <laughs> you guys, you guys we would offer you money. Oh, go ahead, go ahead, go back. You guys ever seen that clip? <laughs> it was it was a podcast too, where it was like some guy like setting up a scenario. Yeah, he he was just like, all right. Ten million dollars. I'll suck it. I'll suck it. Hey, wait, wait! You didn't hear the rest. I suck it, bro. Oh, no, honestly, like, a billionaire <laughs> came up to, uh, up to it, bro, you. And like, I'll give you fucking two hundred million dollars. Just suck my dick, but make me nut. Nah, I'm not. I won't. I'm sucking it, bro. I don't. don't. Two hundred million cash. To completion. Cash. To completion. Saul, but- cash. My dad's retiring, bro. I might think I'm robbing you, low key. So that's all you need for me? <laughs> I know you think I'm thinking, but I'm just thinking about what I would wear. Bro. Uh, dreams, dreams. Like, <laughs> I wear a wig, bro. When, when dreams, <laughs> when this one <laughs> thinks, he looks up like. Yeah, he, does, he, he contemplates does. it. Like, I have yeah. to think he about it about seriously, life. bro. You know the cartoons when they see the little, oh, the little bubbles. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's how he sees it, bro. When I was a kid, I used to drink water like how cartoons used to. How? Go, 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 go. <laughs> Yeah, bro. And then my my uncle's like, "Why are your freaky ass doing this? What the fuck?" That's why I just switched up, bro. Yeah, a long time ago, bro. How, how'd you <laughs> run? Like the narrative has, huh? How'd you run when you were a kid? Oh, you did bro. this before. No. You're like, no, yeah, no. you start off like that, and like then you go off. Ah, you ever do this shit though? Hell yeah, bro. 
to make you faster? I was doing this before Tom Cruise. <laughs> nah. I saw Ronaldo run like that one time, and I was like, I'm going to start doing nah, that. Nah, I saw yeah. the fucking villain from Terminator 2 do that shit, Oh, bro. yeah, yeah, yeah. The fucking dude, like the, the, the little blob thing, yeah. run like that. When he's chasing him on the bike, I was like, that's how I'm going to run. I heard that motherfucker had to train food to run like that. He did. So, like, yeah. he won't look like he's fucking breathing hard for, yeah. like, a year. He was just like, oh, shit. I'd also just believe that if someone told me that, though, too. Yeah. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't have to do I'm anything. Not doing the if someone told me that, I'd be like, yeah, I believe. Yeah, yeah, well, that really happened, bro. It's good enough to, like, not research it. Like, it's believable. Like, yeah, I, I can see that. Yeah. It makes since, sense. Since y'all brought it up right now, just right now about cartoons. Favorite childhood cartoon? SpongeBob. Oh, uh, Rocket Power. Which was that one? You haven't seen Rocket Power? Nah, bro. I had PBS. Like, I was we on, are riders. That Porsche, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, man. Man. Sure. I was Tito. watching Arthur, uh, Uncle Tito. You know, <laughs> we had a childhood. Food. I was uh, SpongeBob, uh, Kids Next Door. Well, as soon as I got cable, as soon as I got cable, Kids Next Door, uh, Dexter's Laboratory. When did you get cable? D D. I was still in elementary school. D But when he got it for like a year, because my dad's like, I don't want to pay that shit. My dad did the same thing. Hey, everybody got Dish Latino and shit. Max, Max, though. Max, though. I'm watching SpongeBob in Spanish, bro. Mom, Esponja. Mom, Esponja. Nah, bro. Ah, fuck. SpongeBob, Kids Next Door. Dexter's Laboratory. Sure. Okay, I fuck uh, oh, Powerpuff Girls. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You yeah, fuck yeah, yeah. them? Yeah. I fuck bro. I fuck. Mojo Jojo. Jo jo. He made that shit, bro. Rex, what was, what was yours, shit. bro? Casting Couch. <laughs> I can like uh, tr from trucking 101, yeah. Big Taxi. <laughs> what's that dinosaur? What's that dinosaur one? The fairy, the fairy. What's the dinosaur one when they got like the dinosaur egg and shit? That was Dragon Tail. Dragon Tail. That was my shit, bro. Okay, shit boy. Me Dragon pretending Tales. not to understand, uh, so I didn't look poor. I, I was a, I was a, <laughs> oh, what are you talking about? I was a bitch when they killed. Rex was watching some shit on Duda. I watched that shit too. Reading Rainbow. His cartoons were like puta majo, puta madre, puta la cocha tu madre. That's racist. That's racist. He just said too bad. He just says the boom of food. <laughs> said, Boom, Boom, Boom. I was watching that shit. Uh, reading Rainbow with the fucking lions. Uh, hell the yeah, hell yeah. Between the lions. Between the lions, food. Yeah. The lions. And then the fucking. Fuck, I could say. Remember Cyber Chase? Cyber, Cyber Chase. Chase. Oh, Cyber Chase. I forgot about that. Y'all watch Max and Ruby and shit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Maya Miguel? Hey, Maya Caillou? Yeah. Caillou? 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 That's Bad fucking hate a little bald bitch, bro. <laughs> he had cancer. It's on side of everything. What's up? Cancer? That's what they said. That's a theory. That's a theory. That's a theory. And supposedly, a number one from Kids Next Door had cancer, too. Damn. Damn. You, you just made it, you they just always made it make real. some conspiracies <laughs> like that, huh? Yeah. It's always the same shit. Oh, yeah. they're all dead. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So that was, that was the Rugrats. That was the Rugrats, right? Yeah. The yeah. Oh, the yeah. Rugrats. Yeah, that yeah. Uh, Chucky's like abandoned or some shit. Yeah. Yeah. Did his mom die? Yeah, I used to yeah his mom died. Wonder Pets food. Uh, Wonder nah, that shit was Pets, hard. Wonder Pets. Uh, the, the Backyardigans had a fire ass fucking intro, too. Yeah. The Backyard. I know it wasn't our childhood, yeah. but I'm saying, like, I, okay, I was watching. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sue me. I was watching cartoons in my 20s, bro. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's because you didn't have a child. No, but, you that, were hey, but that's granite. who got down, though. The, the, little, the little penguin got down at rapping, bro. God. And we and we came to play along. That food was hard. Yeah, bars. You guys, I, he had my respect. Total. You guys remember like when there was weather like this and the TV would cut out because you didn't have like yeah. It, yeah. I had antenna. You gotta go up top yeah, and like, had, snack that, that shit. And then you had to watch. Yeah. That's when you had to watch the really poor channels and you're just watching an Asian lady like sell you, fucking jewelry. <laughs> like I, I bet, I bet you were watching Kids WB. Kids Hell WB. yeah, bro! Shaolin, Shaolin Showdown. And I was all. watching oh, all that bullshit. Shit. Yeah, that, bro, yeah. with Jackie Chan. Yeah. Wait, Jackie Chan Adventures Never you talking about Shaolin Showdown Nah Yeah Yeah, okay. oh, yeah. Man, You were rich yeah, nice. nah, I was, Bro you That's good, when man. I knew My dad loved me food Cause one time It was raining <laughs> Damn No I swear <laughs> Like one time It was raining And my dad like The antenna went out So he's like Chimala madre Hijo tu puta madre No Horta vengo He got his jacket <laughs> <laughs> We went on top We got a ladder We lived in mobile homes If we went on top of the ladder You could've died That food started Fucking fixing the antenna that's when I was like, that food loves me. Yeah. <laughs> I'm watching cartoons. Yeah. Damn. Yeah, like, I, I you're wrapped up in your cobija. I knew my dad loved me for one time. He came from work, bro. He, was beating the, he beat the shit out of me, bro. He was like, I only do this because I love you. And I was yeah, like, this motherfucker loves you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. facts, bro. I'm sorry you went through that, bro. I knew my dad loved me for when he left. He didn't come back, bro. And I was like, fuck, bro. You love me for real, me a though. lesson. Wait. Hey, wasn't it cool that your dad didn't leave you? And, and we, got, we got whooped? Wasn't it kind of cool that, like, yeah, but it was a shock when you went around with people who didn't. Yeah. yeah. I, I thought everybody didn't got beat what? you. That was yeah. my white friends. I didn't friends. think so. Yeah. That, it was a white I had my, my white boy friends and they're like, what? dude, you gotta call what? cops. Dude, your dad beats you, dude. You should call the cops. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they don't respect your space. Yeah. <laughs> they don't respect, they respect your area. <laughs> like, nah, yeah. that shit was crazy, bro. Nah, you're spitting. My dad stopped I, beating my ass, like, I think 
But did you even get hit like that though? Like, oh, bro, like let bad? me tell you, bro. One time, <laughs> oh, you got hit like that. Like, I still remember this shit, bro. <laughs> I still remember. When someone starts to let me tell you, like, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm sitting down, bro. Beto turned, I pulled out the fucking the camera for Patreon. He's like, nah, bro. I remember, I remember one time I was like, I don't know, me and my brother were arguing in the back seat, and my mom were, uh, we were out outside my clinic. Cause I had got chicken pox. Well, I got chicken oh, pox. I thought you had a dispensary so or something. Like, white kid? I was chicken. I had chicken pox. I'm such pox. a white kid. That's kid. white people. Only white people get chicken pox. I, don't know, I got chicken pox twice. Hey, dirty ass what kid. What the fuck? Yeah, you got chicken pox twice? twice? Shower food. I don't think food. you know that. <laughs> you didn't get your shots. <laughs> I swear <laughs> to God. We have all fucked up. You didn't yeah. get the ward. We didn't have money, food. I don't know. You gotta get the ward. God damn, bro. Bro. We, I had chicken pot. We had just come out of the clinic, and my mom was like, "Oh, we're in the way, it's way in the parking lot." My my friend's coming. She's gonna give me something. My mom used to sell Avon back then, right? Fly. Yeah. Remember that? Yeah, yeah. Fly. So uh, she said, "I'm about to go." Sorry, we're we're waiting there in the parking lot. Me and my brother were in the back seat arguing because he had a PSP. I was like, "Let me play." My brother was like, "No, no." I started crying. That was mm. fucking a blunt <laughs> 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 Get it, Get it. <laughs> 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 so uh. Yeah, I started crying and my dad just like, Cállate, no estás llorando. I started crying louder. I was one of those kids where like, ah, <laughs> you know, the mouth wide open. Talking <laughs> to the <laughs> moon. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, so I started crying louder and my dad just turns around and goes, Boop. It was like a movie, bro. I started bleeding through my Oh, shit. That's it. He backhanded me. Blah. That no, no, but in front of my mom's homegirl. Uh, my mom's homegirl was like, <gasps> No, no, Martita, no. Eso no está bien. Le pegaba a su hijo. Y ahorita él está en la cárcel y también la señora está muerta. Oh, shit. I, you know what I mean? That too well, right? Yeah. That's high, bro. Right when this podcast ends, make that into a TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> hey, bro, he's all about content, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, bro. Let's go, Beto. Let's go, Beto. You're on it, bro. You're hey, you gotta pay him. Hey, give him a raise, bro. Yeah, yeah. We gotta, we gotta. Hey, go get another beer, bro. You're good. You <laughs> <laughs> That's why you're just our content homie, bro. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this is but yeah, I remember that day, bro. I was like, fuck. But my dad used to whoop our ass, bro, with, with the belt, with the fucking. How'd your dad feel after he hit you like that? Did he cry? He would Did just he go to his scared room. or something. I don't know. I never seen it. We never got to see his reaction. <laughs> oh, <laughs> nah. He knew he was like, "Fuck, I fucked up." up yeah. One thing, one thing about my pops, bro, that I, that I love about him. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 this fool loves his dad and shit. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what I love about him. <laughs> Nah, that fool Yo, was, you saw his dick or That fool was, Nah that fool was, You wanna take a shot? I was gonna give him a shot nah, I'm chilling, I'm chilling, I'm chilling, I'm chilling. I'm I love these This is good This one's oh, yeah, good. Smack I'll, it smack it My boy needs one No no no, no. It's give, Oh yeah you guys handle, handle. Just, I, I already took a oh, shot okay. You guys have to Nah he just wanted it Let's talk about our dads Let's talk about our dads Why the fuck they whoop us Because they worked hard And then like They took other people You know what's crazy You know what's crazy You started unloading shit That shit gets hot It started back in the day It started back in the day In the fucking 1800s Fool like Motherfuckers were like you know what I mean? And it still went on to yeah. like the early 2000s. You think slaves were hitting their kids? What the? <laughs> oh, nah, 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 like 100%. Egyptian slaves, like just generation of like, hey, like beating hey, up and shit. Yeah, this is kind of deep. Like, Let me think about it. Let's think about that. Nah, that's, that's hold on, hold on. Because fathers it. have tra- deep, traumatized. Like where did it originate? Where did it originate? Yeah. Hey, you think you guys are going to hit your no, uh, that's what I'm, that's the question I was no. gonna ask. I'm gonna no. beat the fuck out of you. Think I might, one day I might just shovel. You're gonna come home and beat the shit out of your kid because you had a you had a 13, 14 hour shift and yeah. your wife screaming at you, your boss screaming at you. Yeah. And then, oh, and then fuck. your kid's fucking crying. Yeah. Oh, shut the fuck I up. wanna raise. <laughs> you just start taking your shit out on him. Fuck. I shove a kid. Nah, Rex. That that what you just brought up though. We're all traumatized. Oh man. We are. I'm I'm traumatized. Fuck. But I have a cool relationship with my dad now. So. Bro, to this day, bro, I be, I be driving my, like, my girl passenger, and, like, she'll just, like, do this, and I'll be like, what the fuck, dude? <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, hey, and she'll be like, what are you, she's like, what are you doing? And I'm on? like, I'm just, I don't know, you, you raise your fucking ass. Yeah. Hey, she goes like that to fake, dude, to fix the fucking mirror. Dude, yeah, dead ass, bro. I'm like, what the like, fuck, bro? Like, you gotta chill. You can't cool. do that when I'm driving. You gotta start a gazelle? Well, I got a few, bro. What are you want to <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, well, it's cause no. Nah, luckily though, like I said, I love my dad though, cause he used to fuck. He's like he used to fuck me up, bro. Yeah. Damn. Like, but he would always like apologize after. He was. Like, it, it Damn, was a, you had a good dad. Yeah, it? bro. It was like a fucking mixture of emotions and shit. Cause he would he would he would fuck me up, and then he'd leave, and then later at night he'd be like, "My bad, fool. I'm sorry <laughs> and shit." Don't know me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And my mom was never like that, bro. My mom used to 
My mom, I got the most ass whoopings from my mom. Yeah. yeah she was a champ. She, oh, bro, she used to whoop my and, and like, she's not like the moms to that uh, you tell them, like, remember you, remember you used to be my ass? And they'd be like, oh, what the fuck? Oh, my mom would denial. be like, okay. she'll say it with her fucking yeah, chest. Yeah, she would like, yeah. yeah, I whooped that motherfucker. He was fucking out of line. But she's crazy, but I love her. She's were, you, were you also out of line? Yeah, hell yeah. Uh, sometimes, yeah. 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 Okay, sometimes. bro, I was a bad fucking kid too, bro. So yeah. I was like, okay, I understand why my dad and my mom beat my ass. No, you had to do what you had to do, you know? Like, yeah. but How also, did you get hit like that? Uh, they, they also say, I, like, that's us just coming to terms with it. Yeah. Because they say that you, we, we, we're always like, oh, no, we deserved it. But in reality, I guess you don't really deserve it. It's just the way that. No, you do. It's the reaction that they had. Yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. So I don't yeah. know. I think that's a natural was, reaction. But, never, but uh, think about it. Then again, sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. No, it's okay. Uh, but bro. then again, think about it. Don't <laughs> <laughs> no, push bro. No, yeah. yeah. right. cool. no, you're the guest I'm or whatever. It, bro. Just take it's a call. Right. Right. No, you're the guest or whatever. I don't my, care. My beer's not even open, bro. bro. I'm gonna cut off Hans next. He always does. He always does. Uh, nah, but think about it, bro. Like our dads will come home tired as fuck, annoyed. He just wants to go home, chill, kick his feet up. But then your mom be like, "Tu hijo se portó mal, ve, pégale." Exactly. You're just like, bro, what the yeah, fuck? Like, exactly. why? Like, no, you're just annoyed. Yeah. I think that's why they yeah. beat us, fool. Yeah. And Loki, my my dad literally just said that shit recently, like yeah. not even like two weeks ago. He was like, because my mom was like, "Yeah, you used to hit him too." Because I was telling my mom like, "You remember, remember you used to fuck me up?" She was like, "Yeah, también tu papá." And my dad's like, "Pero yo no me le pega porque tú me decías." <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Her face and shit. And then she yeah. got mad, and I was like, well, "Am I gonna get whooped again, bro?" Like everybody chill out. <laughs> hey, but sometimes you're in public. Oh hell! Oh no! Yeah, some yeah. kids. Yeah, you can sell the kids who didn't get their ass beat. I might. I'm. I'm not gonna be. My I'm kid. not gonna be a soft parent, but I, I might whoop my son. I'm, I'm gonna put my foot once. down. I'm gonna put Just my foot one. down for sure. Did you get your ass beat, someone? Uh, yeah. my mom hit me the most. My dad fucked with me like mentally. Oh, that's mentally. the worst. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's <laughs> worse, bro. Like what? Like, hey, say, that's like, the worst. I, I'm, like I'm disappointed in you type of shit. Dead, not like dead ass. Just fucking hit me instead. Bro. Yeah, nah, he fucked with me. Don't, mentally. don't, don't tell me I, I, I disappointed you. Bro. <laughs> don't tell me I disappointed you and I'm the worst thing that ever happened to you. And now he was more. Just of tell this... me, you know, hit me. Actually, just do that. It's better, yeah, because yeah. he hits you and still tells you. <laughs> <laughs> and it hurts for the time, but like. It's like he I'm hits th you and he's like, why are you crying? Yeah, yeah. yeah. make you cry more. Yeah. That's shit. And then he's like, get his chivas, okay? Le vas a las chivas? <laughs> and that's, that's, how that's how you'll get me. <laughs> not, nah, bro, dead ass. I'm like, I'm not even yeah. lying, bro. Like, I've, I'm, I'm brainwashed to not like Las Chivas. I fuck mm. with your dad, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, anything. He that, did the right <laughs> thing. Respect got him a mic, bro. Nah, fuck up. that. Fuck that. <laughs> Respectfully, fuck your dad, bro. What the <laughs> fuck? Arriba Las Chivas, way. It was nah, a good joke, like, though. It was it's good so, like, to me, it's like, I, I learned that the word uh, gay was Chivas. Like, okay, Le vas a Las Chivas. You're affiliated with them. Yeah, that's. Okay. So, so I just I was brainwashed into that <laughs> the word association. Yeah, that's association. Yeah. I was like, nah, so. never mind. I'm, I can't. I don't know. Like we can talk about this. No, talk about Hans. I just saw something on TikTok that should piss me off. Hold on, bro. Like, put a sass on. Crazy. Cut him up, bro. No, it pissed me off, fool. I saw some shit that supposedly now people are saying because there was a video of Travis Kelsey doing this. Mm -hmm. And supposedly that that means you're that's just so random. Illuminati. It was random. We were like, talking about Chivas. Fuck, how, no, because it's it just I can't because he said because he said gay. It means you're Illuminati. And huh? this means oh, apparently that like you're gay. gay. No, that's peace. No, but there are people are <laughs> saying that on TikTok. That's peace, liberals. War. You ever seen that shit? That, that's liberals. Yes, <laughs> <guys are>, <laughs> 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 Oh, that's a lamp. That's a lamp. That's a fucking lamp. They want to get you that way. That's got that lamp. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you something. You never see Dale Earnhardt do this. Not that much. God damn lamp. God damn. Nah, bro. White Brazy on the show in the last episode, he had a whole like thing that the that the leftists and the entertainment industry are really trying to make our kids gay. Remember that shit? Hold it. He went like 10 minutes of just like, they're really trying to. I'm not fucking around right now, but they want to make us all gay. I was like, he was being I had to cut that part out, but yeah. Yo, you cut it out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't remember that. Yeah, that shit was, was like, wild. I, I didn't hear that shit. I heard the whole episode. Yeah, you that shit was wild. I was what like, about what about this podcast? You guys with the liberals? <laughs> <laughs> Is this the liberal side podcast? <laughs> what are you, huh? What are you? Right, so what's your guys' fucking, uh, I know the homie okay. Hans is pulling up the, are you going to pull up the video? Donald, I was, hey, Donald okay. Trump never missed oh. a stimulus check. <laughs> obviously, obviously we're in the podcasting business, but like, what's the threshold of where you're like, oh, uh, maybe we should cut this shit out? Um, um, politics. Well, that's a good question. Politics. Politics. Racism. Racism. Yeah. Talk to the blacks. And Joe Biden. Uh, and <laughs> religion. <laughs> religion. Religion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's Brazilian. Religion. He can say that. He can say that. Religion. <laughs> yeah. Uh, politics. No, religion. The? It's like the big three. It's politics, religion, and like 
What was the other one? Sexuality racism. or something? Racism, yeah. yeah. Religion. Hey, but somebody well, should, well, nah, I mean, should, um, should be comedy, huh? You yeah, you, 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 sometimes you can't, like, you can't ignore it. You hey, gotta say some shit. But it hurts, though. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I, I'm sure, like, I'm Gazelle sees most of it for us, but it's like, this is comedy gold, but we can't use yeah, that Yeah, you can't shit. use that shit. It's it, the worst, This is the bro. thing, like, if people want to joke with us with race, because at the end of the day, bro, we all, like, I think uh, uh, blacks and browns, like, we went through the same shit. Mm -hmm. Same struggles. So, so we could say it too. I feel like, <laughs> no, that's what he's saying. No. That's what he's saying. No, that's what you're saying. No, but I feel like, bro, like we can all joke around with each other. But I feel like the only people that get a, that take offense to it is yeah. white people. Yeah, hundred percent. It's a, I think it's the white savior. Uh, yeah, like how the complex. fuck like, you get yeah, the white savior? I'm, I'm gonna be offended for you, type. Yeah, yeah, right? yeah. I did vocabulary for <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, honestly, though, I think it probably derives from just that guilt, though, of like. Knowing that you're the ones us. who suppressed like, yeah. all these fucking uh, nah, races sure. and ethnicities. Hey, hey, Get back like, in line, like I heard Germans. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Germans are super nice. That's, that's what it comes from. Like, yeah, I heard I'll Germans are beans. You know? Yeah, yeah. 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 He, no. He Rex like tells that. me he's like, "Get back in line, boy. You like the <laughs> chewing? You know what's crazy? <laughs> but uh, we don't talk Southerner. We mostly talk like Border Patrol. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're Border Patrol. Yeah, no, like you get back where you came from. You chew. You know how to paddle, boy. Yeah, real grande, real nice. You know what they say? You hop in a boat, you better run. How to that shit? <laughs> uh, you need what? a towel. You want to buy some crawfish? <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, you yeah. like you like that true home boy. You <laughs> yeah. like the way that cinnamon gets in your. Uh, you smell boy. like cilantro. Is that your sister? <laughs> <laughs> Fake chew on some shit. No wait, but that's southern though. You gotta yeah. do it like like, like you like tacos, boy. Yeah, like, it's like a Tex Mex, Mex type Texan. shit. Yeah, yeah, I can't. They all sound the same to me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that ass, bro. They all sound the same to me. That's true. That's except racist. for the, except for the ones like in Louisiana that are like super like flagrant. I say a boy. <laughs> oh no! Wait. <laughs> now you Say talk it, like boy. that. Bro, I want to go lose you. <laughs> Sound like I'm by the by you, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm by the by you. <laughs> wait, so I'm walk us, walk us through that border patrol, like. How does, that, how does that persona like? Uh, well, what what, what is somebody who's a border patrol agent would say? It's mm. stop. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, go ahead, boy. Go ahead and go run down that border, boy. I'm going to give you 10 seconds now, boy. Yeah, look at that, boy. They're running pretty fast now. Where you from? I thought they can't run. I thought they swim fast. Where are you coming from? Juarez? What are you, Achievers? You Achievers? What's your name, boy? Juan? Are you what they call Coyote? Bro, I heard that because I used to truck drive all through Border Patrol. Paso, Laredo, fucking... Yeah, now, all these like, you know, so I would hear them, yeah. and I started fucking around with the homies, and then the homies caught on, and I was just like, yeah. we just spoke about, it. but people think it's southern, but now nah, we're being like, hell with yeah. this. Yeah, we're being border patrol to our own people. Yeah. What the fuck is this blessing the bottle? But it's funny, <laughs> it's funny because yeah. like you can, you're almost. You're you're you're, it's ta healing. you're taking it and you're making it yours. That's like you the know? N word. You know exactly, exactly. You know okay, black people. Exactly. That's what I was trying to say. It is. It is. It is. Exactly. Yeah. Nah. Exactly. Period. You know how black people say the N word to each other. Period. Oh, uh, they, they, they take it. They take it and they they just say it to them to themselves. So to us, it's like. Oh, we can do that too. Like taking Beaner so back. Now, yeah, we yeah. take Beaner. Like, and, and what's up, we've, Beaner? We've gotten yeah. those messages because, like, we'll say Beaner on the podcast, and Way we've gotten back. the like the comments like, "Y'all can't say Beaner. That's racist." Like, do what, better. What do you, what do you mean? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Mira, hijo de tu puta madre. Yo soy frijolero hasta la vida, perro maldito puerco. That's a clip. Consuelo de chivo. Su canto nada. I knew he sound like a spick. That was crazy. That was crazy. That was crazy. That was crazy. That was racist. He's a dude. He's not even Mexican. He's a dude. You can't say that one. You can't say that. You can't say that one. No, no, no. I knew it. Everybody can say that. Now, one time at a cod lobby, they got me with that one with the with spick. Cause yeah. I never heard that shit, but I knew that shit hurt. Yeah. And like, <laughs> what was the I knew that shit? Hurt. I, knew, I, knew I know it felt yeah. entirely <laughs> fucking ass. Remember me and Rex? Oh yeah, we, we got we got uh, we got jokes for white. Um, what was it? What was uh, it? Oh, I, I have it on my oh, notes. I forgot I'll, about I'll that. No, I have of it in all, my notes. All names you could call I think white I have people? it on my notes. Oh, it was on my old. Yeah, I, think, yeah, I remember. Yeah. We did like a what's up, um, cracker? Like a little. No, segment. no, no. There's way. No, you wider than a no, way better. Yeah, yeah. It's like you wider than a white. fax machine or some shit. Anybody like listening? That. If you want to call white person, oh, they were jokes. Uh, de devil. What did I say? Devil. What? What does spick mean? Spick. It's just like a racist derogatory yeah, term for a me for a Mexican. It, mean, like, it means like a short for Hispanic. Yeah, I'll look it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah right. But it's derogatory in the sense like it's spick. It's kind of saying the the n word, the er. Yeah, it's an er. To yeah. us, yeah, it yeah. hurts more than Beaner. They yeah. created that name around the time, like Caesar Chavez time. Did you know yeah. Greaser was a bad? Well, that's word? why they made spick and span. We always kept that Greaser was clean. a bad word. 
Greaser was like the hard R for like Mexicans. Shout out to homie. Really? Which one? Shout out to homie Angel Greaser. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Which one? Greaser. Greaser was like a bad word. Oh, yeah. Like if you called Greaser, it's like a fade. Like what the fuck you call me? Yeah, I, the <laughs> dictionary <laughs> just says a derogatory word for a person from a Spanish speaking country. Yeah. Uh, fucking spick. That's crazy. crazy. <laughs> it's not even, that, that doesn't even hurt though, but it, I guess it would only hurt if you I actually back got it more. like. I no, think beaner is funny. You, you know? yeah. If someone uh, calls me a white boy calls me a beaner, I'll be like, <laughs> that would make me laugh. I think wetback hurts hey, more. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, wetback. Oh, wet I didn't even cross one river. Yeah, what the fuck are we hurt. talking about? I don't even swim. What bro. was the name we, I used to say to like you know it's called a white person like a devil or was it? I don't know. I remember. I, 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 fuck. I, I, I tried to look for a white devil. I do remember that. Oh, Tasmanian devil. Tasmanian devil. I think it was no 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 no. That's just bro. How do you say it like it was? It was just a Looney Tune. It was something devil. Uh, white devil racism yeah oh, hell yeah what the bro my middle school was racist i went to like an all-white school like i i caught i got called beaner the most in seventh grade no eighth grade yeah Damn. i remember uh when i went to eld i was in eld that's right me too you represent uh, ELD hey, hey, hey we were together right yeah english learning development <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. me too me cheers too. to that cheers cheers to yeah. ELD. i cheers was in game ELD. bro our mom didn't hey, know how to fill out the fuck i was an athlete yeah. hey, hey, english honors she, she, she said we spoke spanish at home no i didn't <laughs> hey dreams english, english, english honors AP, AP, AP english AP? bro <laughs> spanish is my first language let me let me let me get a woogity saul let me let me let me get a little woogity woogity shout out to shout out to wait 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 being as rocket let, let the homie tell us about his <laughs> Motherfucker, experience. that's your first beer. That that's crazy. Hot. That's my only beer. Now, yeah, in uh, because I went to like uh this middle school in uh like in Chino Hills, like I was probably like four or five Mexicans, and I was getting called beaner like almost every other week. Fuck, and I remember in my man. ELD class, I remember um I didn't even know what ELD was to be honest, but I just now I was getting taken out of a class, and I heard some people say like, oh, why are they leaving? And then this dude, I remember his name. His name is Jordan. Fucking bitch ass. Fuck, fuck you, Jordan. Jordan. Fuck you, Jordan. He was like, he's like, oh, that's where they take all the dumb ass beaners. And Damn. Like, What's up, Jordan? Yeah. That's it. I was like, little fuck. bitch. Yeah. In middle what? school? Yeah, middle school. <laughs> okay, yeah, hell yeah, bro. Middle school was Stasha. Wait, correct me if I'm wrong, but like Chino Hills is low key like a rich area. Yeah, it's white. Like, it's it's got, it's like, they got oh, predominant oh, rock oh, and shit. Hey, bro, <laughs> y'all don't know this about Saul, huh? Hey, no, hey, 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 hey. My he went boy, to school. No, my boy was born in Lo Beverly Hills. That fool went to school with, <laughs> with the Ball Brothers. Ah, oh, we got to hear this. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I went to BBB? Yeah, they're in my uh, they're in my PE class. I, I like no I, way you they picked you in basketball, bro. No, nah, dead ass. <laughs> Lonzo, Lonzo, he jumped over me for like a dunk. <laughs> that, you that, were on Sports Center. <laughs> <laughs> Look uh, at Lonzo. Look at his handles. Yeah, that's right. your claim to fame. That's hey, Lonzo, you dunked on yeah, me. Hey, remember you dunked on me. Dunked. <laughs> yeah, they were in my PE class. Uh, motherfuckers were fast as fuck. Well, only the only Jello and Lonzo because the other one was still uh, Lamelo. Yeah, he was still in. I think he was like in elementary. Yeah. It's funny, Lamelo's the best one now. Yeah, yeah he is. but I remember we, they they uh even in high school we went to their CIF game. Like their <laughs> their division one, that shit was fucking. Dope Those was were good as fuck. Hell though. yeah, that shit. Was Those was had fans like before. You know, you yeah. could even really have. Bro, they they would come to our school because our school was bigger, and they'll sell out. Like, well, they'll like they'll pack out our fucking gym. A high school game. Yeah, and we're rivals. That's because, fucking wild. Yeah, because we were there. They were Chino Hills. I was at Yala, so we we're rivals. Yeah, but like they would come to our school for like the gym yeah. and just fucking pack that bitch out Isn't our people crazy our, our fucking kids couldn't do that shit yeah it's like lebron huh and like kobe too when they were in high school they just like literally would pack out fucking the yeah. whole a high gymnasium school. and, and, and shit and, 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 like, and if you want to see um what's the dad's name fuck what's his name lavar lavar if you want to see him like he gets donuts like every morning at this fucking like near this gas station right. i always see him don't leak it though <laughs> <laughs> he's always there the homie rex i kind of like hinted at it earlier but he said now he's recently Unemployed? Unemployed. So we're gonna say married. <laughs> 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 I didn't want that in the push up. Nah, nah, you said it right there. Nah, you're, you're, a, you're a dream chaser now. You're is a dream chaser. Uh, are BOP you folks gonna hire me, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know. We got you, bro. We hey, Bethel, you're done, bro. Right, <laughs> <laughs> no, but I know. No more beastos? Fuck. <laughs> Damn. His check's no, gonna be thin. I, I feel <laughs> like every podcast I've gone, they said that. Like, cause it's a big thing. It's a big deal, bro. Yeah. Like, you're you're really. I, I'm I'm assuming it's also you're taking a, a yeah. The, it's step a new into step. The, yeah. New, yeah, into your what you really want to do. Yeah. You know, and it's scary. So tell us a little bit about that. Church, tell us a little about your uh, your uh, fucking drug smuggling. Now, don't give him that attention. Like he, look, <laughs> like, like, he loves that attention. Because right? I did, I did it too, bro. But no one said anything <laughs> like, when I did. It. Like, oh, fuck, you quit your job? Hey, uh, podcast, uh, podcast full time. Yeah. Hey, you you, you, you want to edit dumb shit full time? That's tight, uh, bro. Yeah. 
Now I gotta hear his voice every week when I'm editing. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Hans, you fucking dumb, huh, fool? That's, that's crazy. Get the fuck out of here. That's, you your, that's your best friend. It bro. is, fool. Yeah. They love each other. Fool, Rex, Saul, and Carlos are my, and Kenny are my, my four best friends. And who else? We just keep naming all your homies. Oh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Lano, fucking Dream. <laughs> My boy, all my, best my boy Beto. SOS, bitch. <laughs> SOS. Shout out to Maz. Shout out yeah. to Amiga. Shout out to Japan. Shout out to Big Forehead out here. Shout out now. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I have a little bladder for any yeah. fucking pee. Go for it. Go for it. Hello, hello, hello. I gotta go to Whatever I just pee in the corner, nah, like bring a, a bucket. You don't even want to even hear Rex. I know. That's why he wants to pee. <laughs> I know, he does it. It's like, hey, he's going to talk and we hey, all leave. Hey, Hello, we'll just stop and hey, go. Hey, shout out. For everything I know from. Fucking editing to Photoshop, doing to taxes, whatever. Like, fucking <laughs> direct. <laughs> <laughs> I learned it off this. Mm -hmm. nah, Honestly, the, damn, the and, 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 and everything that's swaggy about you, you learn from this. It's even exchange. Nah, that's so true. That's, <laughs> that's so even exchange, bro. Nah, that's so true. This dude really put me on game, like a hundred percent. This dude, uh, when I back then, when I when I came into the, I, I say the the official because I was in Chino, but Chino didn't really feel like I eat to me back then. Once I started like hanging out with like in like when the Fontana crowd and going to all these parties, I was like a fucking dweeb. I was like I didn't know how to dress. I was I was just a dweeb. And then Hans was like, oh, like here, like, we'll go shopping game? together. He was putting me on game. He's like, yeah, this, 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 this. And then you know, weenie hun. I wasn't nah, a, I, was a weenie hun I wasn't a yes man to him, bro. I was like, yeah. bro, you gotta do this. You gotta wear. This. Nah, let's yeah. talk about it actually. Wait, cause you wait, work because look at this. Can you dress fresh though and still not spend like a stupid amount of money? Yeah, fuck yeah. Bro, bro, cause I can't like. Well, I, I have no style. Bro, bro let like, me tell you right now. I bought some fucking cargo pants, like two from Walmart. Let me dress. Yeah, bro. And you're like, look, yeah, they, like they, they fit fit yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Let's, let's keep it a stack, though. <laughs> also, you're a good looking ass motherfucker, so like you could wear anything. That shit pisses yeah. me off. Yeah. Yeah. That shit. Yeah. 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 You're fucking dick riding, nah, bro. Nah, nah, check crazy. Hey, we're not nah. even in the bottom. Hey, right now. nah, check this out. We the, went the to the dick riding on Benito's crazy. <laughs> Are we recording? The dick riding on Benito's is, crazy. Hey, look, look. Hey, oh, we're back. Look, hey, we're back. And we're back. By the way, we're back. We're, I know we asked Rex a question. We'll get to it. Okay, we're good. It's we, Hans's turn. It's Hans's but, turn. We're talking uh, about Hans. It's Real bullshit, quick. huh? I'm out. <laughs> Let me catch everybody to speed. We're talking about how, like, we're talking a little bit about, like, the nerdy shit on the equipment and stuff. And then Hans said that, like, everything I know about. Hans came out. Equipment, and, 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 and equipment shades like it's because of Saul, and then Saul was like, everything I know about like, like why I'm looking shit, good, yeah. it's from because Hans. Of Hans. So but I'm all, I'm, I was like, but also like, Hans, mm -hmm. I asked him, I was like, bro, can you make like cheap shit look good? And then this fool Hans goes, bro, like yeah, I, like it's, it's nothing, right? It's I'm like, like, bro, you cute as fuck, but it's not even fair. It's not fair, bro. We, I remember when we went to West Ham and Mucho. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, say it louder. Say it louder he, Rex, all he heard Rex. was a whole ass compliment. Yeah, yeah. bro, you compliment him more. Nah, than we, we, hey, Rex, you cute too. Nah, nah, nah. We went to West Ham and Mucho, and we were all excited, right? We all got our best, fr like our our freshest fit. Rex came look fresh as fuck. I look fresh as fuck. Caesar, all the girls, we all look fresh as fuck. Hans. Pulls up almost like he just woke up, yeah. right? I was like, he just woke up, yeah, and I'm like, just scratch his ass. Yeah, I'm like, bro, like, <laughs> I was like, bro, we're going to like, we're going to the festival. Like, what's up? He's like, whatever. Like, I'll, I'll still pull. I don't give a fuck. You can't lie. The hoodie was sick though. It was, yeah, it was, it was a cool hoodie, but he was just very, just like, like, just nonchalant. very scruffy, like I nonchalant. Wearing, I was just wearing cargo jeans, regular tennis shoes. Yeah, and, like a, a fresh hoodie. cut yeah. or no fresh, cut? no fresh, no fresh cut. cut. No, nope. he's like three, four weeks no cut. Yeah, and like so, me, me, Aaron, Caesar, you know, we're like, we like trying to pull up on game, trying to see some girls and shit. And me and Aaron, I remember we're like at watching the show, and we're like, yo, that girl's cute as fuck, some cute ass girl, and she was near us, and then uh, she just comes straight to Hans and just starts talking to him. Like nothing. I was like, and me and Aaron, like, what the fuck? That's annoying, huh? Like, I was like, what the fuck? I tried. Why the fuck do we get dressed up for? Yeah. yeah. Like, I tried for so this moment. I spent 200 yeah. bucks <laughs> yeah, for this moment. Out of fresh cup, fuck. And this man didn't have to do shit. Who we'll rolled yeah. out of bed. She got me hot. Pulled bitches. <laughs> From that day, that's when I was like, you know what? I don't need to tell Han shit. Like he's Was it the confidence? What is it, Han? Tell us the truth, bro. Honestly, bro, look. Hey, speak your truth, though. Mama, speak your truth. It just I think I, hey, you know I, we're here too, right? It just don't, that's whatever, bro. <laughs> hey, hey, sh shut up, bro. <laughs> <laughs> shut the fuck up, bro. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know, hey, you know I'm wearing a comedy, right? Like, I'm wearing a. <laughs> you wearing a comedy and fish, my bad, bro. I mean, oh, yeah. but but like I was saying, go ahead. Hans. I mean, this hoodie was like what, 110, uh, 60. A subscriber sent this to us. 80. Shout out to you guys. That's the homie Juan's bueno, shit. That's JC uh, shit. That's the homie JC. That's that bueno, bueno shit, bueno, bueno money, like my boy. That's true. Yeah, we got that bueno, bueno. I'm not saying, but. You know, you know. What's uh, what's the fucking secret behind like 
looking like I don't know like swag like how do you how do you it, approach it, it it's, it's honestly confidence bro like I, don't give a fuck uh, look this is the thing I always tell my friends and I tell Saul cause Saul is going, going up to girls yeah. and I'm like don't do that damn he call you a chump cause I don't do that <laughs> yo he little bro at me right <laughs> yeah, now he little bro, bro at me right now I don't do that shit bro he like, does like, I mean I have sorry a we're not all attractive this dude will pisses me off I have a girlfriend now this, but this when I was dude, single when I was, when I was single like bro like my shit was always like if I'm gonna just chill, kick back with my homies, vibe, and, and if a girl cool. comes up to me, she comes up to me. Like I see girls staring at me, bro. Like I'm not gonna go up to her, bro. Yeah, yeah. I used to be the same to. way, but then nobody came up to me. I, was like, oh, fuck. <laughs> I gotta start kidnapping these bitches. It's just not, <laughs> it's just not fair, bro. <laughs> bro. Lock that. Put the child lock on. I know what you mean, though. Cause I I had to adapt a little bit of that into like like obviously I don't get the attention that you get with with girls, but. I had to put a little bit shut of... Shut the fuck no, up, Gazelle. No, 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 because you don't know what it's no, like, bro. In up. high school, bro, they never said TVH, and it was like, low-key, like, your best your best quality is your personality. No one ever fucking said about you. Shut the fuck up, Gazelle. Uh, hey, hey, shut yeah. the fuck up, Gazelle. Like, you don't know like what I went through. Like for a TVH? Like for a TVH? Yeah. Uh, bro, got, like, I was 20? a face full of acne in high school. What are you talking about? And then these bitches still loved it, bro. They are like, I love pepperoni pizza. No one give a fuck. That's because I still was, like, trying to, like, make them laugh and shit and, like, talk to them. And also, I think my my a tactic, especially then, was just like, don't try too hard. Like you're saying. Yeah. yeah. Like I didn't have girls coming up to me ever. Yeah. But like did. if I did talk to them, no, I, I really didn't. I really did. I swear to God. Yeah, he did. But I, I would just be like, <laughs> don't try too hard. Don't like give them, don't be like, oh, you're fucking up, beautiful rings. and shit. Like I yeah. never understood that tactic. Lalo, Lalo uh, too, back in high school, he used to have all the hoes. That's what it is. Are <laughs> 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 you? You want me to fucking lie or what? You want me to fucking lie or what? I swear. I swear. Dude, back my, my we, used to, we used to come out of class already. Like, he used to walk two girls to, like, the Damn. classroom. Two? Hey, I had two. He had three. Ah, uh, uh, so sucking each other. Uh, security bro. used to like be like. This. No, he was like. Th no, he was. Okay. Like that? Oh, shit. <laughs> what are we doing? What are we doing here? Oh, yeah. Hold on. <laughs> What's up, dog? Ah, hey, bro, Rex, you good? Uh huh. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Walk into class, bro. I always knew my lane, bro. Like I knew I wasn't gonna get the bad bitches, but I know I was gonna get the fat ones, bro. <laughs> so dead ass, bro. I was just You're talk the up. I'll talk up the fat bitches. Come I'm like, on. maybe they'll get skinny after high school. Uh, then some of them did. Some of them got worse. Now you invested. Yeah, yeah hey, I invested look, time. Hey, you gotta, this you gotta know your lane. I'm gonna like. Hey, this yeah, is my thing. When I was at a when when I was at a club or a bar, or whatever, and we're all going out, I'm gonna be like. Every guy in here, at least not every guy, but at least five guys are gonna go up to that girl. Mm -hmm. And they're gonna say the same fucking cheesy ass pickup line. You Damn. come here often. You Sounds do like this, blah, 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 blah. That fuck so all my like, lines right now. I, know, I, think, I was like, fuck, <laughs> so I, I said that the shit. The thing is, like, girls don't like that shit. They get they do the same shit unless you're fucking Michael B. Jordan. Yeah. You're not you're not him. You're not gonna it's not gonna happen. Yeah. What do you tell them? So I don't say shit. I d I don't say <laughs> shit. But even if they come up to you first, what do you say? I'll be like, all right, I'll start you know, keep it friendly with them, whatever. And I, you know, you know, maybe let them come hang out with my friends, let let her see how fun we are. Yeah. We start partying, we get lit. Yeah. And then we have a table, we're like, hey, come over to our table. And I'm like, oh my God, what the fuck? Why is all his homies Cute. getting at bitches, but he's not? Yeah. I want Damn, him. Damn, that's uh, what you was doing. Oh, I want shit. him. How many chest. times did you steal a bitch from a homie? That's chess. That's chess. Damn. Oh, you heard that? How Rex, many times you did you steal that? a bitch from a homie? How many times did I steal a bitch from a homie? Did you ever? Yeah. Hey, Rex, tell us what's up. Remember that? Remember? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Hold on. Am I fouled for asking that or what? Just say a name and bleep it. We'll bleep it. Just say it so you can hear it. <laughs> what? Rich. My birthday? Remember my birthday? Oh, your, his, your birthday? That was crazy. Can we yeah. say that one? That was crazy. That was back Fuck it, just say it. Just say it. That one was fucking. Give him a drink. Give him a drink. Take a sip. Take a sip. Just don't say that. Tell the story, and I'm going to finish it with some funny shit. All right. You guys are going to fucking laugh. Rex going to be like, well, what's the detail missing, bro? Just finish it. It's cool. This was back in... 2021. 21. Damn, COVID, bro. 2021. <clears throat> no oh. kickbacks. Oh, sick. Yeah, 2021. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it was literally like a couple, a few months after fucking COVID ended, from. Yeah. We all went to, uh, <laughs> what's it called? Um, uh, Prohibition. 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 It's Prohibition. In, uh, Riverside. Riverside. Down, uh, downtown Riverside. And we went there for brunch, food. Yeah. So yeah. one of my boys pulled up with a girl and whatever. They pulled up as a date. I don't know. I don't know what was going on, but they pulled up, right? Together. Yeah. And we're all just vibing. It was his birthday. We had a table, whatever. We're chilling, bro. We're vibing. <laughs> and then out of nowhere, bro, I got so fucking drunk. Next thing I know, this girl's in front of me and I was like, like, yo, what's up? Like, like let's dance. And then we started dancing together. One thing led to another. I got horny. 
<laughs> Damn, that jumped. For sure. Yeah, like my shit got hard. Wow. I don't know. Like, it, that shit was wild. I'm not controlled of them. You know? Yeah, yeah. It has a mind of its own. Yeah, yeah, I feel it. So whatever, I got horny. And then she, literally, bro, all I remember was she's like, so are we going to go fuck or what? Straight and I up. was like, and I was like, I'm sorry. Like I heard it, but I wasn't sure if that's what she yeah. was saying, right? And I was like, wait, what? She said, I'm gonna go fuck. And I pulled down my phone. I was here, type it on my phone. I can't hear you. Pulled <laughs> <laughs> on my phone. You need her consent, phone. huh? I think yeah, you yeah, screenshot yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Are you recording where you're recording? Yeah. So she dried it on my phone. She's like, Are we gonna go to your car to go fuck? And I was like, Say less. At that time, when we had got there, I had given my keys to Rex's uh, wife because mm-hmm. I was I was gonna drink. So I gave him the, I was like, hey, I was like, give me the keys. <laughs> Went to the car, whatever, I'm going to go do my thing, whatever, it came back. We're coming back, you have to pay to to, to re-enter. Again, yeah. She paid for my entrance and she paid for a drink for me <laughs> when we're in there. You did that Sick. Can I tell you? Damn, bro. All right, can Damn. I tell you the nasty part? Yeah. Uh, tell, tell on the it. way home, I sat on his fucking jizz. <laughs> 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 Not- <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> hey. Ain't no the worst part. The That's dude, bad, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not, and the worst right? part. Yeah, someone had to sit there, right? <laughs> a little white it spot. Was like where, and I had to sit there. And I, had to, I had to fucking all the way. It was wet. Like, Would you guys fuck in the front seat? Nah, oh, but nah, but check this bad. out. This is the worst part. This was the worst part. He takes so this dude, uh, the guy, our friend, comes with some girl. Hans fucks this girl. The dude still takes her back home. Mm-hmm. Like he still took her back. Nah, home. and that's not even bad. The other <laughs> homie, when this one comes back, yeah. He's, you know, he re-enters the club with her. He comes back. The She start working the other homie. Damn. And we look at that homie like, ah, she was bro, bombing. what the... F-? Like, bro, you know you... Bro, that ain't crazy. no fun. Hey, you don't get the homie can't have. You know that, homie. Yeah, we sure. toss, bitches. Let me text you right now. All right, man. We toss, we toss. Bro, and yeah. it's like, I, I looked at the homie like, bro, why you just... Nah, mom, that's you just, scandalous, just, bro. And then the other yeah. homie's gonna take... Oh. God, y'all, ever, y'all ever still hold from the homies? Uh, us, maybe bro. not even on purpose. Maybe actually. Nah, we we literally like we we lob him up. Yeah, be like, hey, Dwayne Way. Yeah, we you know, lob him. You know Jeff Hardy, and <laughs> his brother. Yeah, Matt Hardy. Matt Hardy. There's this one time I don't know if you uh, like remember um bro coming out the car like <laughs> have you gonna say like that? like Hans pulls out the ladder <laughs> and say <laughs> uh, and I forgot with the B or some shit. <laughs> I forgot her name. But I remember you called me. Be like, hey. Oh, you were drunk as fuck. Well, they gonna glaze each other. Nah, y'all. Good, I like, thought it was the one where we're, you were we're driving the. Truck. You gonna say that story? I mean, we're, we're oh, nasty motherfucker! Shit. Yeah, okay. that was crazy. Yeah, which one, which gonna one? get you in trouble. You gonna say the was... car story in the truck? Hey, I'm that in a relationship wild. now. Hey, bro. I saw the same. That was a pass. That was a pass. If you can get you in trouble, don't even say that. Nah, that was a pass. gonna get haunted. Nah, but I bet you it's a fucking like a superpower to have fucking a cute ass homie around. Just be like, we just be loving him because you're fucking welcome. You get a cute, yeah. Shout out Lalo. You're welcome, bro. You're gonna get the. You're gonna get. Some nuns. home girl, and then she's gonna have <laughs> other home girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's like it's yeah, but the other home girls are always fat and ugly. Man. <laughs> Bro, you know, one time I had to take a, I had to take one down. Oh, for the homie. you did. Yeah. I took one you down for the did, homie. You did. You did. And like, I'll never like. This is some shit I'll say like at his wedding and shit. Like I like. This- <laughs> Show? That yeah. shit was crazy, bro. Cause it was his birthday, right? We all it was his oh, birthday. I, about that. Yeah. Was, I think he was like a month single. Yeah. And th- and that girl Don't tra- say his name. No, no, that girl yeah. treated him so bad. We're like, bro, you need you deserve better, right? Yeah. And we're like, it's your birthday. We're gonna go to our favorite club. We're gonna have a good ass fucking time. And I'm gonna make sure you dance with someone. Yeah. You'll get the works. And um, we're there and we're like, I'm having a good time. Everybody's having a good time. The night is, it's like one, it's pushing 1 a.m. or some shit. And then my friend, he's like, I, I see him. He's still not dancing with anybody. And I'm like, bro, like, who do you like? I'll tell you, like, we'll make this shit happen right now. He's like, yeah. that girl over there, I think she's cute. And I'm like, let's go right now. Yeah. So we go straight to her and then um, the song's going on and I grab her hand and then like I spin her, like she thinks she's dancing with me and I spin her around and I put her around my homie. Yeah. And now I got like three seconds to act. Yeah. Because next to this girl. Uh oh. You got is a fridge. You got wide receiver. You got a whole line. You got a whole line. Too friendly. Yeah. Yeah. You got, a left guard. Is... You got Jason Kelsey in front of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So <laughs> about to snap the ball. We <laughs> So I have to act quick. Touch, push. Touch, push. I have to act quick because right now her friend, she's not looking. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I know as soon as she looks, she's going to be like, wait, what the fuck? Oh, right? I hate a bitch like that. Yeah, yeah. So I knew that shit was going to happen. So I took a deep breath. I was like. <sighs> and she took a bigger one, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I said, hi. <"Hey."> yeah. <laughs> you went. Okay, you went. You went. I was like, I was you like, went. <laughs> and she went. Hi. <laughs> and I go. I, I like. She you went. Around. She went. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> 
One and time. I, she sucked like, them up. Like she turns around. <laughs> now, bro, she turns around, and I'm like, I gotta do this now. And I take her hand, and I spin her again, and I, I, she started mm. working my shit. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, what the fuck's going on, bro? This girl, when I tell you, this girl was wide. Mm. This girl was, was wide. Wide load. Put your blinker <laughs> on when you turn. <laughs> wide bitch. Load. He Even, needed. He needed an extra hand. How to? Yeah. Look. I had to go like that. Uh, you did that shit, and it took a whole day to get yeah. it. <laughs> <laughs> even my homies like Aaron Kendrick. like even, I like him even Aaron and Jamo they saw me dancing and they're like they're like what the fuck saw it yeah. but like I, I did it for the homie you gotta do it bro yeah I had it that's a real ass homie that's a real ass homie bro I, I wouldn't even I'd be I'll be like that fool's real as fuck right there yeah so I can't like they can't talk shit cause like I was the real homie I was like if you need a guy I'll, I'll be that guy and uh, that shit was wild. You know she was cares? having the time of her life, too. She, she had the time of her life. She had a great time. It's yeah. funny because I remember... Out of breath, uh, but she had the time <laughs> of her life. <laughs> that shit reminds me of the... Um, I know you... I think you guys talked about it on IE and Friends where Hans had uh, the homegirl pull up with like linebacker shoulders. Oh, yeah. And that shit had to be... That shit... A was linebacker. probably like <laughs> you guys know the linebacker top five linebacker stories shit. of yeah, all yeah. time bro. the linebacker that shit was bro. hilarious bro bro that shit like even even my girl knows that shit bro like, <laughs> even sh to this day she'll roast me like okay you fucked the linebacker <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, oh fuck. Okay, you don't got a game. Yeah, hey, you yeah. got a point, you got a point. Yeah, but then I got tickets to the Rams. So <laughs> <laughs> what are we talking about? Like nah, you came bro. with me. We got the Michelada together. What are you talking about? Uh for I mean for you guys' fans that don't know, like I, dude, that, that day was crazy, bro. Like I, it was when I was on my single shit, I was just fucking around. I was horny. I was on fucking Bumble. Cause on Bumble, I don't know if you guys know this, but nope. on Bumble, <laughs> they have the girl has to hit you up first. Oh, uh, uh, okay, okay. So you have a if you're ugly, you got a chance. Yeah. You got a chance, right? Yeah. Here. Yeah. yeah. Right? You you wouldn't know yeah. about that, but yeah. <laughs> you looking at me for? <laughs> <laughs> Why are you looking at you? You got yeah. a chance. Yeah. Yeah. What yeah. for? What the yeah. fuck? Maria was just lying back in story. Nah, yeah. but, yeah. <laughs> hey, we still haven't got to his question. <laughs> I know, I know. I'm literally I thinking about it. Right what was like, it? What was it? I forgot his question. And he's waiting like. It's, mm. it's, it's about how. He's he's like, when is it my turn? He's really he's pursuing his dreams. He, he, okay. He's he's jobless. All right, but but no boring stuff. Let's go back. Let's go back to the fun stuff. You want to say your story though? That's crazy. No, no, no. We're talking about linebackers right now. Yeah, linebackers. Talk about how you got the biggest bee in the honeycomb. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, ah. <laughs> uh, Look at this Grenady. Pittsburgh Steeler ass. <laughs> Tell the story how you how you black and yellow black and yellow pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, uh, so the, you know whatever. Uh, I met with this girl on Bumble, <laughs> and I was talking to her for like a week. Cause I don't know about you guys, but I can't fuck right away. Cause like my dude, same, really, bro. bro. Yeah, yeah. I mean, my I, dick don't work like that. Bro. I need a connection. Yeah, same. I, yeah, I need a connection. I need to build something. That's why I always say I love you. She first. needs to. See <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding, bro. Hey, yo, Beto, you got that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Beto, you got that, Beto? That's Patreon, Patreon, Patreon. So whatever, you know. So, uh, I, I, I bond. I like, you know, made a bond with her, bro. And, the, you know, one thing came to another. She sent me nudes, whatever videos. And I was like, oh, yeah, I'm excited. Like, yeah. yeah. So I remember that day I went to fucking to the liquor store and I bought a fucking blue rhino. <laughs> For sure. oh, yeah. You about to hit it one, huh? Yeah. Rhino. Those of you don't know what blue and, rhino and is. Judging, uh, judging from the, the videos and the, and the you pictures. You about to go through all Africa. Everything checked out. You were like, oh, Bro, yeah. Everything checked out. But back then, I didn't know that you can save a video and it'll show you the exact time and date that they sent you that video. Oh, shit. So I don't know if you guys know that. Yeah. No, yeah, I yeah. About that. Said that on the camera time, roll. In case you don't know. In case you don't know. <laughs> Hold up. Don't be mad, Rex. We're not talking about you. Hold up. I know. I know. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. <laughs> we'll get to you, bro. Oh, hurry up, bro. So I did that, bro, and that shit was fucking crazy, right? I took a fucking blue rhino. I fucking vacuumed my room. I cleaned the fucking bed sheets. Everything, bro, was perfect. Candle. Yeah. And I was like, hell yeah. I even beat my meat. I was like, fool, I don't want a nut quick. Yeah. Mm. So, you know, whatever. She's like, hey, I'm on my way. I was like, Start doing some push ups. <laughs> <laughs> physique, physique, food, it matters. Yeah. Like, I, do a punch. So I was working yeah. out too, so I was like, I was looking kind of cool. Maciso. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. You know? So, whatever. She's like, hey, I'm outside. Mm -hmm. I'm like, all right, cool. That's the best. I see you. I'm like, fuck yeah. <laughs> I go to the mushroom, I, I spray some cologne. Some light. Whew, I'm like, all right. Because it only lasts 30 seconds. Something heavy. I'm like, all right, let's go, let's go. We, we out here, we out here. I go to my, because I have a back, uh, back, uh, back door to my backyard. So okay. that's when I brought, brought in like everyone, right? Yeah, yeah. So the shipment. 
Yeah, the, the precious yeah, cargo. Yeah, yeah. The white load. <laughs> <laughs> you two shut the fuck up. <laughs> no, it's true. It's true. We're, 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 we're putting not. in the details. Yeah, right. Yeah, I want the viewers to know. Off, in the yeah. cargo garage. I just want you to feel the like. Beep. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I want you to feel like I'm like you're there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So she's like, hey. I'm so here. she walks up, right? So she walks up to the door. The truck driver she walks up. up. She's like, hey, I'm here. I open the door. She gets out of her fucking door. She walks towards my door, and I'm like, "It's a big ass door." And I see her, and I see her, and I'm like, <laughs> uh, <laughs> "That's I'm not like, the no, girl from I'm Bumble." Like, no fucking yeah. I stopped playing Hunger Hungry Hippos a long time ago. I was like, "There's no fucking way." Yeah. I was so mad, bro. I was pissed. I was like, "Damn." But you were hard as fuck. But I was hard <laughs> as fuck. <laughs> but I was hard oh, as fuck. And I was no. like, hey, my shit's hard. This shit is not going to waste. Like, I'm not going to let it go to waste. Yeah, it's fact. Yeah. So whatever. You know, she comes in. You know, she's like, as soon as, I swear to God, as soon as she comes, I have two doors. My back door and then the room. I have my own restroom. So as soon as you walk into my restroom, it's my, my main, my, my bedroom. She walks in through my bedroom. She's like, well, let's get here. Let's come. Oh, what did she say? She said. Let's. She said, beep, "No, she beep. said, let's get to it. I didn't come here for nothing." She grabs me, fool, and I'm like, "What the fuck?" Oh, oh shit! Fool, my dick goes soft right away. Uh, off the I rhino stuff. Off the rhino, bro. That's wild, right away bro. It goes soft, and I'm like, "Bro, there's no fucking way." Shit. And I'm like, "Oh, I can't do this, bro." But you know what? I'm a fucking. Got to see it through. I'm a man. Got to see it through sometimes. <laughs> and I ended up doing it, bro. That's yeah. right. Mm -hmm. That's real. cool, bro. I was forklift certified. It's all good. Yeah, game is game. Yeah. Game is game, bro. Game sometimes. Game. But honestly, yeah. she probably, she was like, you wouldn't believe the guy I fucked, bro. Yeah. She's, She's probably, probably like, I that. fucked that one motherfucker. Uh -huh, that motherfucker nah, high, dead man. ass, bro. She probably did. She That's probably doing that. She's probably like, oh, you see that podcast guy? Yeah, I feel Yeah, you're her bragging yeah. rights. Bro, bro. Yeah. like, that's oh. hard. That's dope. That's dope as fuck. Oh, my God. And you get to say, like, yeah, I fuck Lizzo. <laughs> like I get it, right? She wasn't your your favorite of all time, but for her, she was like, "You're a dreamboat, fucked hard, yeah, bro." Yeah. And then you look humble as fuck. You were a dreamboat. Like, like damn, you, damn, you, you're down there digging in the gutter like that. That's crazy. The make a wish. That's so humble too. of you. You know what she told me? She said, "Eat my ass." I'm like, "Oh, <laughs> no, no, I ain't that hungry." Hey. <laughs> I'm actually full. I just ate her. Right <laughs> yeah. like, my mom made some chilaquiles. Like, yeah, oh she, she wanted some too, huh? She's like, yeah. You got extras? You got some? <laughs> you got some. I Can I take some? I remember when you first told that story. I was, bro, I was dying, bro. Like that was. That, I think you were a guest on on IE and Friends, mm -hmm. and so, I was yeah. like, nah, this motherfucker, dude. That shit was just funny because like it's relatable as well. You know, just everybody's got a down bad moment. Yeah, yeah of course. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. You know what's and crazy you pull though? Through with it. Yeah. Exactly. And you know what's crazy though? It's like um. Everybody's been down bad and everybody has a like uh they given up a lot, right? In their in 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 life and work and shit. And yeah, sometimes fact. you want to pursue your dreams. So go, so go, 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 go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. What the fuck were you what saying the, earlier? That was a great, great transition. What the fuck were you, great, great that transition. Was nice. so what the yeah, fuck were you saying, bro, right? Yeah, that was yeah. a good transition. What the fuck oh, were yeah. you transition? Yeah, I got you, bro. My hair. Yeah. My bad, bro. I, 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 I've been I, doing I, it for uh, a couple years. So I'm speaking of speaking of diesels. Yeah, yeah. Nah, I'll set the homie up. Damn. We did it! Nah. You laid me up like that? That's Come on. Man. <laughs> so, I know the homie, like, Speaking of way. semis. Uh, speaking of Mack trucks. <laughs> speaking of a <laughs> Ford Raptor. Yeah, that's right, brother. For, yeah. for, those, who, who, for those who, like, uh, King obviously tune into Bueno Bueno, they know that Rex was yeah. a, a truck driver prior. And um, honestly, like, everybody knows that, like, truck drivers make stupid bread. So the fact that you're taking this mm. this step into like really pursuing your dreams is like honorable, bro. So I want you to tell me a little bit about how like that you even made that decision. He's like, yeah, we know you're getting paid more now. So what's up? How much you're making? <laughs> <Nah>. <laughs> you gotta have the. You nah, signed the NDA. You signed the NDA. <laughs> you can't say. <laughs> NDA is crazy. You can't say no. <laughs> but now, bro, I mean, it's, I, I really thought about it for like a whole year that I don't really want to drive anymore. I think the industry has changed, even the economy. And I could say, like, I've been driving for eight years. Damn. So it's, I've been really tired, you know. <laughs> nah, bro, I, plus, I want to do something else. So uh, right now, I'm really looking into a different career. I don't want to pretty much jinx anything because yeah. I, I, you know, like, I'm really following. So my music, I think uh, right now, just really been working on my music, just really trying to drop my, you know, kind of like Mass and Wolf Lodge. Yeah. Just trying yeah. to drop my shit into labels. Uh -huh. Really like not trying is. to get short, uh, shows more, but really focus on music. And then the pod, you know, but right now, I think right now I'm just trying to get situated because I've never had a schedule in the past, what I could say, like eight years. My my life has always been on fucking, the road. Yeah, on the road. Yeah. 
I think I did four years and a half on the road, so I lost half of my teenage life and shit. But, uh, but I still try to manage my my time, you know, because driving like all states and going to Texas and back, that shit really took a whole toll on my life. Of course, bro. Yeah. And, and then the you rest don't miss of the it year, at all. Huh? You don't miss it at all? Like, hell no, I don't miss it, bro. No? I think like after my accident, my shit changed a lot. Uh, after that, I started driving locally. Well, local drivers, you know, make a cool amount of money. It's not like out, you know, out of the road, but, mm -hmm. you know, and I just felt like I never had a schedule and that's always been my problem in my life. So right now I'm just <clears> really <throat> trying to schedule my whole life and take, you know. Well, obviously, you, you hinted at it earlier. You said that, like, uh, well, actually, I think it was off the podcast, but you said, like, you come from a family of drivers and shit. Yeah. So, like, when you say the news to them like how what's their mm. reaction yeah with my well i could say with my pops you know pops are always gonna be like mad whatever decision you do but he understood that like you know what you've been working so hard for all these years also you've done it you know like you actually did yeah. it yeah bro i started driving i could say when i was what, like 16 17 yeah because when I, I met you you were already driving yeah i was parking That's them bitches. crazy bro i was like and mind you i look younger than all my friends i look fucking like I look like a little kid still. Still the same height. And, bro, I got my <laughs> license when I was 20. And I could have got it when I was 18, but I got it when I was 20 because, like, when you, well, technically, you got to be 21 so you could drive, like, without anybody next to you. Kind of like a, you know, yeah. a permit or whatever. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I got it when I was 20, bro. And literally, I look like a 17 year old kid still, 16 year old kid. Yeah, hell yeah. And, fuck, I, like, looking back, bro, I did the hardest shit. Like, I, I fucking. People think a truck driver is just a truck driver, but there's there's levels to that shit. Yeah. And I think I, I my dad pulled me with like the baddest drivers and put me to do some crazy ass shit. He put you to the test and like, shit. Yeah. Bro, I fucking I've t I've <laughs> gone to under under underground militaries to you know pick up mili military cars in the in the flatbed or step deck. Mm -hmm. I've gone to military bases. I've gone like picked up helicopters, importing cargoes with like permits. I've I've done like crazy shipments. You think that's wow. his way of showing you that like he loved you? Like I'm trying to give him a better life. Like, yeah. Shit. Well, it it was like a lesson, but it was also like there's pros and cons to everything. Yeah. So I think my dad really like he fucking went hard on me than anybody like any of his drivers. So it was a blessing, but I look back and I'm like, oh, like low key could have gone easier. Yeah. Because yeah. I that shit did fuck me up mentally. Mm -hmm. Cause there'll be times I wouldn't be home like two weeks. Yeah. yeah. There was one time I wasn't like it was like two years I wasn't home for Christmas, New Year's, for real? holidays. I, I spent it alone, so it was like it created a, it created like you know it fucked me up in a way. Yeah, yeah. that's the hard part when you work with like family. Yeah, yeah. since uh, like especially like if uh, whoever's in your family is like above you, like in a manager position or something, they'll give you all the tasks that they don't feel as comfortable giving someone else. So yeah. they're just overloading you with tasks. Yeah, and that just yeah. it, it like it hurts you mentally. Do you think it? He did that to make it, like harder so you wouldn't want to do it or you think he, mm. it was the opposite where like if if i know if my boy could do this that he could do anything now nah, at that point Which yeah I could, I could think so but around that time my dad um disclosure i mean my dad was he had a you know his trucking company he had like 12 trucks my dad was making i mean i'm i mean i'm grateful that my dad was making over over a mil a year yeah. you know and Dang. And it was just, I think it was just the pressure of the business. I thought I was. He was an entrepreneur. <laughs> I did not know this. It was, was. it was the pressure of the business of my dad, like, trying to keep the business going. Yeah. It was that, you know, my, you know, we grow without papers, so it was more like, you know, we got to keep it going because we never know, you know, one day we might get deported and we got to keep the money going. So it was, it, my dad put a lot of pressure on me. Yeah. 100%. And then, but then towards the end, I mean, he, we both understood that, like, you know, everything happens for a reason. You know, a lot of a lot of accidents happen. You know, I lost my I almost lost my life. A couple of the drivers almost lost his life. My dad got sued, I can say, like five times. He went to court. He lost eleven trucks. Fuck. His business went down. We all went down, but we you know, we still keep our head up and shit. You keep yeah. on trucking. I keep on trucking and shit. Yep. But thank God, like, we cool, you know, we we're all right. But I feel like he could have gone easier in a way. Yeah, because I I did suffer a lot, you know. I could say, but I feel like it it, it built it, it builds you into the man you are today. Because think about it, if he would have never pushed you, you would have never like been through whatever you've been through. And like, let's say you would have been through it later on, then you would have like took it a different way. Yeah, because I feel like now you know, so it's like it made you in a certain way. You're like, you know what? Like, nah, fuck that. Now I know how to move differently. Yeah. Now I know yeah. which move. How to set boundaries. Exactly. Mm -hmm. so like now yeah you, you you're definitely make a a good case you know it's just it's harder to like 
really understand uh, Rex's experience because he's the one who fucking lived it, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. So he you all he sees the negatives more than the positives because you're living yeah. it. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, you do. You're grown now. You see the yeah. positives and shit, but you felt the fucking negative. Yeah, at that That's moment, the difference. at that moment, it was all negative. Like, yeah. yeah, like you can, as an outside perspective, we're easy, where it's easier for us to be like, oh, but your dad gave you character and he gave you, he showed you how to work hard for your shit. He showed you how to fucking, mm -hmm. you know, all these positive things, right? But you felt what it was like yeah. being in that situation. So, you know, it's just, it's just like, you can't be too hard on your pops either though because you know, no, Obviously, yeah, you yeah. know how like where they come from and shit, and like yeah, their no, life yeah, experience. I, I understand that. Yeah, shit. I know my pops. Like, like pretty much, I didn't grow up with my pops, bro. I grew up more with my uncle. All my families are truck drivers. I can say my, all, like you know, going back, all my grandpa. So mostly in the family, I think the trauma we have is that we weren't there to give time to our people because we're always on the road. So that's something that I want to change my life to because yeah. I want to be there for my son or my daughter. I don't want to be out there like working too much and not being home not being focused because it's not about the money you make bro it's about the time you spend it so you could you could work six seven days a week but you don't got no time to fucking spend your money you That's don't got right. time to spend and trust me bro time goes by quick these eight years for me went by fucking fast but i think the realization i think for me what kind of shifted was my uncle like passed away during covid and this fool had like two months to retire mm -hmm. And he was gonna retire like from oh, truck driving everything. That shit really brought me down to the point where I'm like, I don't wanna do this anymore. Like, cause I saw him as like, like, you know, my role model and everything. Yeah. Like I know my dad and everything, but my uncle to me was like my like my role model. And then once I saw he he passed away and everything, that's when in my head I'm like, nah, bro, it's not working. This is for me, like truck driving is not for me anymore. It could be yeah. for someone else. You know, there's money to be made, there's money lost, but it's like for me, it's like nah, not anymore. But what, uh, if you don't mind me asking, what did what did your uncle pass away from? Oh, for COVID. From COVID? Yeah, oh, okay. right on the COVID, he passed away, and he was still working. I was working. All all the truck drivers that I know were working hard on COVID. Yeah, because there was money to be made, but it was like we're risking our lives, bro. Yeah. Damn, bro, that's a fucking tough pill to swallow right there. Yeah. Bro, Damn. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm I'm glad though. Like I'm not obviously I'm not glad that your uncle. Passed <laughs> That's away. fucked up, bro. I'm saying I'm it's saying, saying I'm sad, bro. I'm saying I'm glad that it's you came. Fucking role model, dude. <laughs> I know you're just fucking role model. model. This Crazy. comedy podcast, but yeah. <laughs> I'm saying I'm glad that you came to that realization of yeah. what what you're gonna prioritize first in your life now. You know, because like I feel like sometimes life puts you through shit for you to understand. Um, yeah. What you what you really need to be doing, you know? Yeah. But there's some things that I always tell people. It don't matter if you're of high class of of like jobs or career you know it's not meant for you. There's moments where like, fool, you could be a lawyer, you could be a doctor, or whatever, edit any career. But there's some people that live in a miserable life because they're like, yeah, I'm getting this money, but it's not really what I want to do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm okay. not really happy. Yeah. So they, they end up hating the job, they end up leaving the job, or they end up hating the job and the people they work with because it's like, they don't want to do this. They, they want to do their something. kids. Yeah, and, and that's exactly what, um, if I speak for myself, my pops didn't want from me. Like, because I remember, I, I've said this before, but I'll say it to you guys. I'm, I don't know if you guys have heard it before, but uh, I would see my other friends' parents be hard on them, right? And like, and I would see them like press them to, you're gonna, you're gonna be a doctor, you're gonna, be, you're gonna do this, and you're gonna, no, nah, you need to study up, study up, study up. And I would, and I remember like, I, what I took from that, from them talking to them, I was just like, why the fuck is my dad like that to me? That's fucked up, bro. Like, I want my dad to be like that with me. And I, I went to my dad and I asked him when he got back home from work because we worked like nine to nine, you know? Yeah. And I was like, hey, like, why aren't you rough on me like that? Like, I see all my friends' parents like, hey, go, hey, you better get good grades. You better, you better, you're going to do this for the, you're going to do this. And he's like, because cause when I die, because I'm going to die. Yeah, that's exactly what he told me. Because okay. when I die, I don't want you doing something that, I wanted you to do. I want you to do something that you want to love for the rest of your life. Damn. Because why? Why would you live for me? I want to die. This is what he told me, bro. Like, I might yeah. have your fucking death. I know that's <laughs> that, big it, up it, to it, your dad. It was, that's it, crazy. It, was, it was crazy when he told yeah. me that, and it made sense to me. Yeah. And then, like, of course, I, my dumbass went and said that to kids, and then they went to argue with their parents because I, I was like, because then my, your friends ask you like, your dad yeah, doesn't yeah. do this to you. It's like, no, my dad wants me to do something that I want to love, find something that's that dope. I love. Yeah. But then like they go and like take it to their parents. It's like. Well, all those parents want him to just fucking do what he wants to love and figure out what he wants to yeah. do with the rest of his life and be happy. And it's like, see, that's great that your dad he broke that generational trauma. So maybe something like maybe his like his granddad was, was that's kind of what he imposed on him. He's like, no, you got to do this for me. 
And then your dad felt how he's like, that didn't make me feel good. So now he's breaking that trauma and he's like, I want you to be better. That, it's, it's crazy, crazy. bro. It, it, it's, yeah, it's, I, I I've had crazy, conversations bro. with your pops where he's telling me like, his, by the way, his dad's like a beast on the guitar. Oh, hell yeah. So he uh, has... Was that him inside right yeah, now? Yeah, yeah, he's okay. inside. Cool. So yeah. he's like... Uh, he knows a little he, bookie, I, We've talked to him before and he's like, he's told us like about like his dreams of like being like a... Yeah, good time. And he's he had opportunities and shit to like actually be playing, mm -hmm. but he had to like kind of give it up for his family. Yeah, and like for, ruined it. Huh? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that mm. <laughs> okay. you, you can I think you can that, you can joke, but but he's he said that before. Yeah, uh -huh. like, but like I, mean, but, I, I love my mom, but that's what he says. Like, yeah, like yeah, he had to sacrifice. Yeah, but like he had to sacrifice it for them. Yeah, so that's why I think that's where that like viewpoint comes where he he can be like no i want you to do what the fuck you yeah, want yeah, to do because yeah. i didn't get the chance to do it you know how many times that fool has told me shit about like girls and shit like he's just like just don't he's like he's like you know my story with your mom and uh, my parents are divorced if you didn't know but like uh he's like you know my story with your mom and I, like i love you guys and everything obviously like you guys are like i, I sacrificed everything yeah he's like but if i could tell you something like that i regret it's like just chase your dreams and pull out chase your dreams exactly <laughs> essentially out. chase your fucking dreams yeah. chase your dreams and it's like yeah. no girl's worth like your dreams as like a 100%. man just, just go, go, go for your dreams yeah the worst thing is regret like once yeah. you're like old that yeah. like when you're old and wrinkly and you look back at your life you're like i wish i would have done that mm. it's too late i could have so, yeah. that bitch yeah, yeah. so that's that we're in the moment <laughs> yeah i think i think people forget oh, we're man. in that moment where now we're yeah. we're at the age where we can go like Live our dreams. That's yeah. why I'm really proud of Rex. Bro, that's yeah, true. Yeah. Think yeah. about it. Think about this it. This is the moment. Like we have the freedom. Our dad were told like, no, you go into to to that, mijo. Mira, cogí hasta tres, cuatro. Me todas. No me importa. Yeah. No me importa. <laughs> <laughs> Yo cuando so think about it, bro. Yeah. <laughs> right now we're like, bro, at this age, like just fuck it, do anything you want. We're not gonna yeah. be like. One thing I I love to say is like. The younger you are, the least the the cheaper your mistakes are. Yeah. So the older you get, they're starting they start to get more expensive. So make those mistakes yeah. early on. Yeah. Like always like the best thing in life is to make mistakes. Mm -hmm. That's the best time to to like learn. Yeah. If you're making mistakes when you're like 40, 50, 60, now you probably got kids that gotta reap the recup like the recup the yeah. repercussions. repercussions. repercussions yeah. You got mortgage, you got all this stuff. So right now that we're like free, like do that shit you want. You know, one uh, thing that I just wanna like you're in that moment and then know with like I hate people that say, I'm rich, not my kids. Like, I'm going to make them struggle. Like, no, what the fuck, bro? As a parent, I think personally, and I'm going to speak for myself, like, I'm a, I'm working this fucking hard so my family can have a fucking nice future. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's just the way I see it. Like, why the fuck am I going to make my kids struggle? Like, mm -hmm. obviously, as a, I think that's some white people shit. I don't know. <laughs> I think, I, like, I think Shaq says that. As a, like, yeah, yeah, Shaq said right? that, yeah. Maybe black people think Yeah, but he know. lives in regret, as he said it before. Bro, but it's like, bro, fuck that shit, bro. Like, I'm gonna fucking make my fucking kid, like, grow up a certain way. I'm not gonna make him be a, snot, a snotty little fuck. Like, no. Yeah. Yeah. Really, what that is, is just being a bad parent that you can't raise your yeah, child, bro, right? Like, nah, fuck I, that I think shit. it comes from a, like, I, 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 I also agree with you, but I think it comes from a place of, like, oh, I'm trying to teach my kid to like make their own money you know what i'm yeah. saying like my money is not your money but you're right like but let but let's be honest but, if we're talking about Shaq. yeah he also cheated on his wife and shit yeah but there's a way throw, like, to, to to no of course to of course, amplify of course. like or like show them like the way like you do shit right yeah, yeah. like if i have my if i'm my kid cool you're chilling for five years or for two years, I'm going to lease this BMW for you because I have the money to do that for you. Yeah. So you can get a taste of what it's like to live the good life. That's true. Mm -hmm. But when that lease is over, I'm not paying for that. If you want to pay for the lease That's or if you, want, if you want to, it's on you if you want to pay that lease, but I'm not paying it. But you got the taste of what it's like to drive the best of the best. Mm -hmm. Now, it's either we cancel the lease or then you go find your own fucking car and you and you drive a Nissan Sentra for a while. Shout out my car. Yeah. But like <laughs> you go drive that car for a while and you, you're like, oh, but I like the Beamer. Yeah. Then go chase that shit. Go chase That's it. Wow. You, go know, chase that you shit. know what's funny about this conversation we're having right now? Like I get that from both. I get those both worlds in my life. Like my my pops is like that where um, like how you're saying, Hans, like when I grow like when I'm older and I have kids, I want to give them the world. That's how my pops is like. He's just told me multiple times like. All this shit that I have, which by the way, he, like he's done well in his life. He's like, all this shit is for you guys, like me and my sister. My fuck has like twelve houses, bro. And he's <laughs> like, all this shit is for you guys. And my mom's like, no, que se vaina la verga. What? <laughs> he's like, no, it's no, eso no es para ellos. Like, like that's so how my mom is, right? When like, not that any of them are wrong, but like that's, that's what I'm trying to tell yeah, you. It's like, like two worlds. It's just yeah, the, yeah. the perspectives. Like, mom's like, they gotta work for their shit, and my dad's like, no, I want to 
give yeah. them everything you know yeah. okay I, I think that's what as at least like as men like we we want to like have a better future for our i mean look i'm gonna say it's for men right because i feel like men and women are two different things when women make a certain amount of money they want to be independent and do their own shit but as men we make a certain amount of money and we want to build the fucking family and provide for our future yeah. for our future family so that's the thing i see it like i want to fucking have this much money, start a fucking family, build fucking companies, and have for my kids and my for my wife. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? Yeah, hell yeah. I want to make sure everyone around me is fucking set for the rest of their fucking life. Mm. I want to make sure everybody around me is down. <laughs> like that. <dead ass. laughs> I want everyone poorer than I want me, bro. everyone sure is fucking I want to stand up over above them and be like, "What do you want, peasant? <laughs> what what do you want, peasant?" Is my mom. Like, this fool. Ah, this fool last week was like, "That ain't your money. That's my money. That's <laughs> my bro, money, motherfucker. Fuck? Go get some bitches, bro. You really <laughs> want to be on top of it, bro? No, but honestly, like." R rolling it all back up like i'm proud of you rex like bro like that's dope that you're fucking following your dreams like yeah. we're, obviously all of us are like clear examples of like us trying to follow our dreams and shit because like yeah, yeah. this space isn't for the weak mm -hmm. like you're literally putting yourself out there to be judged and shit like people are like yeah. oh those motherfuckers are just you know uploading shit on the internet it's just yeah. a little side work yeah. you know? and shout, and shout out to, to, to hans so like you guys are just as well you're completely in this entrepreneurship right like that's it you're just that's the only thing you guys do. Yeah, like, no, I'm still, I'm still working. It's, just, it's still, it's very like motivating. Like I want to do that shit, bro. I just want to do that. No, I yeah, appreciate you that. Guys bro. Are, you guys are yeah. fucking all, all guns blazing shit. Like that's, yeah. that's horrible. Uh, literally, all guns. If one thing about me is I'm gonna tell you to quit your job and I'm gonna tell you to like drop out of school. He got mm -hmm. to me. He got to my head because like I'm, mm -hmm. I got to this dude's head because. I feel like it's everything is so possible once you realize that there's no such thing as competition and there's enough money for everybody then everything's possible. You're like, okay, we don't need to like, we don't need to argue. We don't need to compete. We don't like, it's, it's all out there. It's just people make us think that we have to like compete versus each other, but it's also possible. And there's enough, if there's enough, there's enough audience to go for everyone. There's enough money to go for everyone. And then at the end of the day is like, if you truly, truly like trust in yourself and you know that you're going to make it, that's all you need to know. And from the rest, like God universe will do its thing. Cause, um, it's always good always gets rewarded it's just everybody believes in karma but they always see karma as negative but karma it can also be positive mm -hmm. so good will always be rewarded and everybody just stick to what you want and uh when you when you at your lowest that's when you should feel the happiest like i've always felt my happiest at my lowest like i, I get to my lowest and i'm like oh shit but it's cor it's corny as fuck but it's like it only goes up from here and it's so true like yeah. i've um whenever i've been at my lowest i've i had moments where like maybe the next day or the next two three days something great happens you just have to like stick by it Hell yeah so um it's it's super possible like that's one thing i live by it's like go try it why not the big thing is why not like we're so young we like we have we have all the time in the world like the way i like to think it's like four years high school everybody thinks like oh four years four years is a lot we look at sure, high school high school went by so fast so you have four years you can have four years to fuck up and you'll fix it up in the next four years Correct. like shit it like time is irrelevant you just fucking just just try it why not i yeah. wanted to ask you something rex how, how did you feel about your girl coming into the space and shit because i know she had her podcast prior to joining the I'm besties yeah i mean um starting off like when before my girl made her podcast um with her home girls it was i don't know like <laughs> you want to say so what well like i don't know i always <laughs> thought an idea like oh you know what if because you know the you know the besties or whatever they um mm -hmm. whatever fast forward i guess uh my girl, I, I, one day I told her, I was like, oh, yeah, like, no, in my head, I was thinking, like, oh, you know, what if she's, like, a third co-host, you know, because I mm -hmm. know he had other thoughts and shit. Mm -hmm. And then, I guess, like, throughout the years, me and him, we jumped an idea, no? Yeah. Until we actually, like, he to asked executing. me one day, like, yeah, you know? Like, we kind of hey, did it. We did, it? like, the, we were doing, like, the guest thing. Like, we had her on a guest, as a guest, mm -hmm. and she killed it. She's actually, she holds the record for our most viewed clip. We, By the way, it's on, uh i.e. and munchies on oh uh, i am foodie, foodie no I am foodie, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Where, where she went bonkers for you guys i remember that shit was everywhere like other people were reposting yeah it, yeah that where she, it was, i think it was, was like uh, she's not jealous yeah. she's territorial yeah, yeah yeah that shit went crazy that, yeah that was bro. over like for the last time i saw it was like over 12 million views that's when i first heard of her yeah. Yeah. yeah and then so like that one wild and then i heard the homie rex was dating her i was like that's right <laughs> <laughs> nah, that's right married bro so, like, like, married. so we just started <laughs> that shit right <laughs> we had her on a on, as a guest again for besties and like the audience reaction was great like people loved it mm. and so we had her on again and then it was great as well and then um when it came to this conversation of like i think it's time for a third bestie 
she was a top contender already. Yeah. And then so something I talked to Rex about is see how he he feel like what he thinks. He gave me a good word. One of her friends gave me a good word. Mm -hmm. And um, everything everything seemed like alignment. Like I talked to the girls too. Yeah. They were like they loved her every single time they were on. I was like, this looks seems like a perfect match. So why not? Let's not make it happen. Still it's funny because I remember like the the her first episode where you guys announced it. Like the comments were like, yeah, we already knew. Yeah. yeah <laughs> They're all yeah. like, yeah, of course it's of course yeah. it's her. Yeah. And she's killing him, bro. Mo she's most of the times yeah. I'll ask her like, you know, what do you think is a possibility? And she just felt like. You know, she had her best friends. You know, she was her and the homegirls went on, and she just felt uncomfortable at first. And I was just like, oh. In my head, I was like, I kind of wanted like her to jump, but I, you know, I respect her. Yeah. You know, she has her pod with the homegirls, and I know around that time when she had her pod, um, you know, I think uh, there was like talks of so like maybe handling the podcast or maybe have their podcast join, you know, the network. But you know they they were like no we want to handle ours so mm -hmm. you know I'm pretty glad she's she's my girl's finally on and everything, um it's just you know we're married and shit so there always has to be like some kind of privacy in the yeah thing. that's yeah. true we we don't yeah. wanna we don't wanna like explore it too much or yeah. people enter our our marriage because you know that's what usually fucks up relationships mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, more yeah. marriage because. That's they can either judge her. I don't want nobody to judge my girl. Or, I think that's one me, thing you know? I told you last time. I was like, you got to be careful because I feel like once you... Because, I, I mean, for like those that sharing. watch me, they know I have a girlfriend. Yeah. But no one knows what my girl's name is or what she looks like because I keep that shit private. Honestly. Yeah. You got to keep it that You know? Way, you know? So yeah, I, yeah. I think it, it's very... <laughs> can't scare the hoes. It's very... Yeah. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's very hard, bro, like, to have <laughs> something the like that. The late ass laugh. <laughs> You like that shit, man? <laughs> <laughs> you like that shit? I don't know. I love my girl. <laughs> <laughs> how, how long you with your girl now, bro? Uh, we, uh, we, 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 we've been on and off, bro. We've uh -huh. been on and off, but uh, I I know her now for like two years. Okay. That's but, uh, you know, we're doing good now. But, yeah, it's very hard, but I feel like when, when, when you have like your partner doing the same thing as you do, mm -hmm. especially because, you know, we, we all do a podcast. Mm hmm so it's very it's very complicated. It can get a little little tricky. Mm -hmm. yeah. But I mean, yeah, ISIS fucking kills it, bro. Like mm -hmm. I've told Saul before in the past, I'm like, bro, ISIS I has something. Mm -hmm. Also, has, also she she's has very it. intelligent. Like yes. it, it, it translates through her. She she's very she uh, uh intellectual. Intellectual. There you go. That's the word I'm looking for. That's the homie's girl, Fucha. And, so. and I, I know her joining the besties. <laughs> I already knew from a far away I knew what she was gonna bring. Cause her and the homegirls, like, they were also doing the whole research thing about like you know, she loves talking about politics. She's, you know, she got her degree on, on politics and everything. So I knew she was going to bring a whole different dynamic. Yeah, her, and it's 100%. like teaching the audience about new things, about everything she learned in college. And, you know, she, she I, I already knew she was going to do that. So I'm happy for her. Yeah. But when I, it comes to our marriage, like I, I had to talk with her. I'm like, yo, we got to. We gotta keep so it some ground. We gotta rules. keep it some ground rules because I don't want nobody like yeah. stepping into our marriage because that's you know that's yeah. different. That's, that's 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 real life. That's smart, bro. Because like us going into this, like it was very like fucking just wild, right? Like yeah, when wild. we when we first started doing this, it was it was who would have thought? Yeah, like who would have? And I was just saying crazy shit. And then like now that you get a little bit of an audience and they hear the they hear even like past episodes of you saying like the craziest shit, you're like. Oh, Fuck ass oh, shit. And then, yeah. girl, and then your girl yeah. gets mad. And then, and and then my girl's like, like in the professional field, like yeah. doing some like legit shit. And I'm like, why the fuck did I? Fuck yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. So yeah. like that's smart that you're going into it already with like that. Oh, so you that feel communication. it? So you feel it, huh? <laughs> you feel I it? I feel it, bro. I know. So that's why I keep my I keep that side of my life personal, private. I'm never. You, gonna, well, you, you, you're never gonna let. Never gonna out. show her. Yeah. I'll show the oh, back, the back of her, like you know, the back, you know, like, those cute, those cute moments, but like never, never gonna. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm because at the end of the day, so bro, who's not gonna go do that, wrong, bro? <laughs> never show. So you're gonna date like an OnlyFans girl, bro? Let's keep it a yeah. stack. Yeah, but you don't want to show us what we like, what we don't see on OnlyFans, like <laughs> is her being out, that <laughs> her personality. But, but you see, like you see how these suits, like you know what they say is yeah. for me. Like I'm very comfortable in my marriage to kind of. Have my girl, you know, take a stand and do, you know, let her. Because other motherfuckers be like, no, what the fuck? You ain't going to do that. Yeah. Like, me and my girl are like best friends, bro. Oh, you may say I'm insecure? What? Yeah, no, no, insecure. no. But I'm saying there's certain foods that are, they'll, they'll be like, oh, I don't want my girl doing podcasts. I don't yeah, want, yeah. like, nobody to get inside her brain or her right. world. And, like, me and my girl are really comfortable with each other. Because you got like, messages, no, of people saying, oh, like, yeah. oh your girl. My girl also got said? messages of, like, oh, look, you know, talking saying. shit, yeah, and, yeah. you know. That's fucking annoying. But, I, like, me and her are comfortable, and we have our both boundaries towards each other, like, where we cut shit off and all that. That's good, bro. Yeah. 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 The, I mean, the only reason why I keep it personal is because she tells me, like, I want to keep, like, I want to keep us private. 
Yeah. I don't want no one to know me like at all. Like, cause she, what she doesn't want is for someone like to message her and be like, "Oh, Hans said this about you." Blah blah blah. She's like, "I'm gonna hold resentment uh, against you." Yeah, of mm. course. It's gonna be like in the everybody bag. has their boundaries. So I'm like, bro. all right, I respect that. So then that's why we just kind of like drew that line where I'm never gonna show her. Hell yeah. Uh, you know, All right, guys. Yeah. I think it's a good point to fucking end the pod. It's been, bow, honestly, bow, it's been a bow. fucking dope ass conversation. Hell like, yeah. Wait, I love this, is, this shit. Is this probably, is this it's one probably, of the longest ones we've ever done? This fool's head hurt, Tom. He's like, <laughs> you got, <laughs> what is scoliosis? <laughs> my, nah, man. My boy it, Bethel's this got is, cramps this, yeah, right yeah, there. Bethel, how much they pay you? Pistols. <laughs> 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 you got two, three pistols. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's hey, That's your advance, too. You want to pay more? You want to pay more? No, this, yeah. that's his man. <laughs> I'm just yeah. kidding. I'm just kidding. That, but honestly, this was a fucking dope ass time, man. You guys are fucking dope. I mean, we already knew that going into this, like you guys were gonna be a fucking vibe because you guys' this podcast is obviously like it does well for a reason. I think that's why we chilled out on the podcast that we recorded before. I think because so. we were oh, kind of yeah. like yeah. we were subconsciously like, nah, we got yeah, save you know, ourselves. it's funny, it's like because we, we gotta save the ourselves before this, but we were very <laughs> mellow. Yeah, but it was because we we're like, all right, well, we're gonna have the boys on. Like, what are we gonna talk about? Like, it, it'll it'll be free flowing, but you know, you still want to have like some sort of structure. Yeah, yeah, right. But like, I think we were kind of in our head on huh, the first. Yeah, on the yeah first like we didn't even drink. I don't think none of us. No, we didn't drink no. before oh, we started. So you guys, get, our, you guys been filming for like six hours. Yeah, today. Yeah, guys were nervous. Y'all have done that though, right? Yeah, you guys done that. I'm so sick of it. Sure, you guys done double. They done like four or five hours. Bro, we we've, we've gone so we filmed and then we gone here and then we gone to a oh that's what we did show. last Saturday oh no yeah. last Saturday oh my god we went to a show last Saturday I got bit by a dog oh, that <laughs> shout out we could to do a whole that. another episode uh, huh? shout what was to her dog. name shout, shout out to uh, shout out to last one in nos vamos yeah yeah that's right yeah. yeah oh yeah that's right you guys were on the I actually yeah. listened I listened yeah, yeah. to the podcast them? shout out to them yeah, yeah I love them um but anyways like as you know what keeping on the same track that you already said like shout out shout out to them shout out yeah. to uh, fucking everybody who'd be listening in mm. and uh shout out to anybody who you guys would like to shout out yeah, Saul, make sure already you plug been about this so go ahead Saul. <clears throat> yeah, shout out to um all the viewers if you guys came here from bueno bueno make sure you guys stick around bueno, bueno. Bueno. uh like comment share subscribe mm -hmm. uh thank you you guys for giving us the space this was uh yeah, yeah. honestly this was uh i love this episode this episode was dope it's as fun as fuck bro. and it it's went fun. so fast when you when you uh when you mentioned how long we've been recording you said like what two hours two hours three hours bro <laughs> yeah that show was wild but two hours and 36 minutes yeah, yeah. Crazy. Yeah. so if you guys made it this far shout out to you shout out to yeah. you shout thank you for giving us that time and uh appreciate you guys all for having us make sure to follow me yeah. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah yeah follow me at rex b same thing shout out to you guys shout out to beto working the fingers <laughs> you know? yeah 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 shout out to beto because i know his fingers are tired yeah. nice yeah. i know his fingers are he's strong. a beast at this bro he's a beast got some strong fingers i think they need some wings <laughs> uh, yeah, some beer. I got you. I got you. I got you on your first beer, my The library. The library. Oh. Okay, let's just go to Hong Kong. Go ahead, Hong Kong. Uh, you, know, you, you know, shout out to shout out to uh, Ponte Las Pilas podcast for having. Yeah, us. shout out. Uh, yeah. To uh, shout I know you, to you guys have Saul last time by himself, but this time you guys have us. Yeah, we got you. Thank you. Shout out to Beto, of course. Shout out to Beto. Shout out to Gazelle. I finally know why they call you Gazelle. Shout out to Rex. I'm trying to put. Here. Shout out to Beto. He has that long <laughs> shit, huh? He has that long shit, like. Mm. Oh, yeah, well, on my end, shout out to our sponsor. Um, we got a new sponsor recently, so shout out to them. Uh, shout out to all the comments that be, you know, tuning in week in and week out. Mm -hmm. Shout out to the motherfuckers who are going to fucking follow us on Patreon, because I know uh, Beto's mm. been in the fucking workshop, just been working cut. it up. Yeah, yeah. Cooking. Check out the Patreon. But more importantly, shout out to the homies from Bueno Bueno for pulling up. It honestly truly means a lot, because we know what it's like to be in this space, and like, you hit up people, and like, hey, pull up, and sometimes people don't. <laughs> You're just like, oh uh. my god, last so it always week. It always means a lot when people do pull <laughs> up, and like, they're, they're, uh, they're men of their word. Yeah, so yeah. shout out to y'all. And if you guys guys are pop followers and for whatever reason you guys don't know the homies from when bueno, bueno, go ahead and head on over to the inland empire network yeah, they yeah. Uh, they upload every what uh tuesdays 8 a.m what time Hans? uh <laughs> tuesdays 8 a.m damn <laughs> 8 a. i'm out there editing now oh, <laughs> so if y'all want to come uh come through you know we have an inland entertainment network on youtube uh we post every monday tuesday wednesday and Thursday. Thursday. My personal Thursday. channel Friday. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Uh, Thursday. Yeah, oh, but yeah. don't 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 look at that. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but yeah, shout out. Go go ahead and follow them. And for whatever reason, you guys are living under a rock and you guys haven't seen them. They 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 upload dope shit. Obviously, you know. And and for the ladies who listen to us, if you guys, they also have the IE and Besties, which is oh yeah, the best. It's a great show. It's um 
but yeah no we appreciate y'all and that's in that's in for my shout outs yeah. uh, i want to shout out my girl mm, oh my girl too my bad oh we <laughs> shout out girl yeah, you know what you, i want to shout out his girl too <laughs> for <laughs> him uh, i want to shout out my family friends everybody's been listening shout out you guys for coming on thank you guys very much uh make sure you guys comment down below online to enter the one-on-one giveaway <laughs> we're giving a full way a free a free lipo suck animals and, yeah <laughs> And a week, <laughs> and a weekend with Cole and Dylan Sprouse. The sweet thing. Yeah. Oh, forget. Uh, uh, thank you. I want to thank you guys for coming on. You guys are funny, and it's it was cool. It was like kicking. You know. Yeah. You guys are homies now, so yeah, I appreciate the that. Thank you. Hey, bro. I I can't look at Rex in the face because he'll make me laugh, bro. Bro, you're the oh shit. No, no, bro, you're the fucking funniest, bro. Uh, and with that being said, I think I'm gonna end it. I'm gonna hand it off to CEO over here. Yeah. Uh, so shout out to fucking Rex and Hans, aka Bueno Bueno. Shout out to them for putting up. Uh, if you came over from their channel, uh, put in the comments, tell them to have us on their shit so we can call some of y'all and, and fuck around and, and fuck around and find out. Yeah. You know, we'll, we'll go over there and give y'all like life changing advice. You never know. Oh, shit. I might change your life. But who knows? <laughs> you never know. But uh, yeah, shout out to the whole fucking team. Shout out to you guys again. Shout out to fucking Beto and the ones in two doesn't have a mic. Beto, you want to say something? Go ahead. Just shout out to Bueno Bueno. And your girl. Yeah. So shout out. And your girl. And my girl. And, and his girl. <laughs> hey, uh, shout out to my girl. That's right. Uh, yeah. uh, uh, you know, little save at the end. Uh, yeah. After the I'm linebacker wrong. story. Because I'll put a picture <laughs> of her. Oh, well, we're doing that. Hey, shout out to my wife. Oh, oh, yeah. Shout out, oh, shout out to a picture of all of them. Shout out to my situation oh, let's, let's go. Let's go. Uh, you know who you are. Yeah. Yeah. Shout out my barber. <laughs> hey, oh, for real. Shout out my barber. Shout out my barber. Shout out to my barber. Uh, you got multiple barbers. Uh, yeah. Shout out to my son, You're a slut. Shout out to my hoes. You're a slut. But uh, yeah, shout, shout out to, everybody. to Shout out to Shooners. Yeah. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Oh, shit. The wings are crazy. The wings are fire. But yeah, shout out to everybody here in the studio again. Shout out to all the homies. Shout out to everyone who listens every fucking day. Shout out, uh, 3 a.m. We're going to be there. You already know. We drop at 3 a.m. Shout out to truckers and everybody. It's Damn. scheduled. No one's up. Uh, shout out to Javier. Yeah, shout out to yeah, the homie Javi. Shout out to 49ers. You, you the homie up. Kenny. All that shit. You know, you guys, you guys linked us all up. Shout out to my family. Shout out to my girl. With that, we out. Peace. Bye. Bye. Bye.